I swear, the way Becky just like closed her eyes to absorb what Freen said, I know she was like, baby, it's gonna be real one day. Just wait, just wait. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> So here's the story. The joint, the um, the one standing in front with the bow, her name is Charlotte. Okay? Her name is Charlotte. The one standing in the back, her name is Ingfa. Just let me get into it, right? Ingfa is uh she was Miss Thailand, uh, Miss Grand Thailand, the beauty pageant. If you follow beauty pageant, she was Miss Grand Thailand, and then she went on from winning Miss Grand Thailand to uh winning runner up for Miss Grand International, right? So she came second in the world, most second in the world, okay. Um she basically was an out, she's an out bisexual, okay? Um, doing these pageants, beauty pageants. Oh girl, she's like 27 years old, she turns 28, I think, this month. Oh, girl, Charlotte, the younger one, the taller one in the front, she's like 24. She just turned 24, too, in like December. Ingfa is basically like, they call her daddy. Like the other, <laughs> not even joking, the other girls literally call her daddy because that's how she carries herself. She's got like this feminine, masculine energy going on. Is is intoxicating, I swear to God. Well, anyway... Well, anyway, yeah, Becky is Sam in real life. That's what I said, too. That's what I said, too. I said Becky is uh, Sam in real life. Well, anyway, um, Charlotte, even though she was like, she was like, yeah, because I've seen some of their, their lives in the beginning. Charlotte was basically on some, well, yeah, I'm LGBTQ, but I've never done anything with a girl. And Frank, and um, if, if Ingfa was like, you should try it. Just like that, right? And that's basically where that shit started. Then they went and did this little like um, back and forth thing about like, oh, we're just sisters and we're best friends and blah, 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 blah. I'm going to show y'all something. Now, they still have yet to confirm their relationship. But if you've been following Inglot, if you know what I'm talking about, if you follow the Inglot path, you know that after the um, grand, the Miss Grand International um, uh, uh, contest in Indonesia, something changed. Something changed. I don't know what happened. I think they took that month apart. It was like, cause basically some shit happened. They, and, um, and Ingfa had to be gone for the month while she was participating in the contest. And when they came back together, the energy they've been given ever since has been different. But anyway, I'm gonna just let this play so y'all can get an idea of who they are. But um, YouTube is, on, is my only social media. Which episode is this, Nikki? This is not an episode. What are you talking about? Oh, she got zaddy energy. Just watch, just watch. <laughs> <laughs> They're both gorgeous. Like Charlotte is obviously beautiful, but Ingfa is everything. It's the face and the energy. Just watch. Got me addicted. Yeah, let's get to the good shit. Puerto Rico Miss Argentina got married too. I heard, yo, this was like the gayest beauty pageant ever in generations. Like everybody out there was gay. <laughs> like it felt, that's how I feel like. And everybody, look at, bro, look at Ingfa. I ain't playing with <laughs> don't she look like she can pull off masculine she can pull masculine and um oh they do have a series coming out you're right you're right so this these shots right here are from a series they got coming out called show me love which is another thai series another thai drama a love drama which i am going to be watching it's another girl love series so i'm gonna be watching that too so y'all be prepared for that you said the season was gay as hell this is the gayest it's ever been it really has it really has. <laughs> Coming between February and March, yup. Yup. Oh, so y'all be know, okay, my people got... My, that's why we here, man. We here. <laughs> 
Now they claim that they're only on some Easy and Natalie shit. They claim, but the difference between them and Easy and Natalie is I think Easy and Natalie were actually friends. I know some of y'all think that they was messing with each other, but I think Easy and Natalie were actually friends until the love confessions. I just think y'all know my take on it. I just think that with Easy and Natalie, the love confessions that we saw versus the love confessions that actually happened, I still think it was a reenactment. Y'all can come for my neck if y'all feel like it. I don't care at this point. But with them. They be claiming this sister shit, and I really think that they really hunching behind closed doors. <laughs> they really just... And y'all, you'll see what I'm saying, bro. They knocking it down behind closed doors. Nikki, can you do the finale live as well? Oh, I'm definitely reacting to the Gap series, the last episode, episode 12. I'm doing it live, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> she be busting them walls down straight up, and every female that comes across comes across um Ingfa, every female be hooked, straight hooked. I'm trying to get to where. Look at this shit. Man, get the dishes. Hold on. I'm trying to find something. Because almost everything has music in it, bro. Almost everything. You know what? I'll give y'all something. I got some. I got some creep shit. Hold on. <laughs> I have some creep shit. Wait a minute. That's not what I thought it was. I thought that was something else. Oh, and Heidi? Heidi also has another ship. I don't. Th Heidi and this girl's not really doing anything. But Heidi and this other girl from the beauty pageants named Tina. Heidi and Tina. What they call it? Hyena. <laughs> hyena got some it. Yo, hyena's energy is crazy. But they're just flirty friends. But these two, these two are definitely knocking it, knocking each other down. Um, I'm trying to see. What do I want to show y'all? Cause almost everything got music to it, bro. Uh, okay, okay. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I got you. Let me go to my favorites. Hold on. Am I in the right side? Yeah. Let me go to my favorites. Go to favorites. Come on now. Where is it at? It is right... As you can see, I've been stalking them. Hold on. It's this shit right here. I'm gonna let y'all see this scene right here. Not this. This that doesn't matter. When I tell you this joint right here, this scene made me. Uh, this joint made. Okay, I think this is. Is this that? Is this that? Is this that? Yeah, this scene right here is what made me fall in love with Ingfa. I love her daddy energy, but I love that she's daddy, but so feminine about it, right? So listen, you said she gripping the, the whole today. Not crazy. Hold on. Listen. All right. Now watch this. Watch this. Watch this. This is it. Y'all see Ingfa? Ingfa was the one. Hold on. That's a better angle. Just wait. That's Ingfa that's dancing right there, though. She's down. Just, just wait. Just wait. Just wait. But the way they all treat her, you see how everybody is going to her and making sure she's all. They that's how they all treat her. They treat her like she's like royalty. I mean, she is the. She did win Queen Thailand. Like the beauty pageant, like she was the queen of Thailand as far as like the Miss Grand um, uh, Beauty Queen. But the way they treat her is like they really treat her like she's an old rich man and they all trying to get their money. They all trying to get some of her. That's what they do. Look. That's Ingpa in the front. Oh, oh my god look i'm so like i'm so in love with her bro but anyway she um i'm trying to see i want i want y'all to see like up close because these the quality of these videos be like whack sometimes because it's all coming from like cameras and concerts and shit but um hold on oh okay i you know what i'll show y'all this i know this is kind of out of context for y'all because y'all haven't been following it for real for real but this joint right here, when she was, um, they went to another, you know, after they both won their crowns or whatever, they went to another, um, beauty pageant 
and Ingfa had a tuxedo gown. I didn't even know they made tuxedo gowns. Like it's, it looks like a, like a dress with a jacket and a shirt. It's not. It's all one piece. It's a tuxedo gown. Look at this shit. Look how she carries this joint. That's what I mean by like masculine femininity. She's got it down. Listen, watch this. That's Charlotte feeding her a strawberry in front of everybody. A strawberry. Music be dumb loud, bro. Ingfa knees is expect Bro, right when I saw her knees go, like somebody said her knees go crazy. Bro, her knees, she got knees like Megan. She got knees like Megan, bro. When I saw her do that shit, she was just down. I said, girl, I look, look. Y'all wanna know what I did for real when I saw that? Do y'all wanna know what I did for real when I saw that? <laughs> Say yes if you wanna know what I did. I've seen Tux Gowns. I follow queer tailors that killed it. Yeah. Let me tell y'all what I did when I saw that joint. When I saw that scene, when I saw that scene, I <laughs> when I saw that scene, I um I watched it about uh I, I I think I watched that one scene and I'm not even joking on repeat or rewind for about 15 minutes. Now I want y'all to understand what that translates to. That scene, that that just that piece, just that little piece right there. That thing was about what? Four or five seconds. I watched 15 minutes worth of five seconds. <laughs> over and over and over. I was like, and I didn't understand. I was like, bro, why am I so mesmerized by her? But apparently that's just the energy she gives off. That girl got some hoodoo or voodoo or something working on her behalf. She be bewitching bitches. <laughs> she be bewitching bitches. Shit better than me. I got knees like Mabel. Girl. Girl, <laughs> I got knees like an ex football player. How about that? What's up, Michelle? Lo, that's a whole gown, bruh. Look at this one whole piece, even the undershirt. Oh, see, I don't know if this music is copyrighted, so we're going to go ahead and have to... <laughs> we're going to watch that in silence. Because I don't know if that music is copyrighted. But, um... Charlotte is gorgeous, too. That's Charlotte. She's the other half of the of the thing. But, um... You said Freen got you like that? Just wait. Just wait. Like, I, I wish we could... I don't know how to go live and, like, show y'all. I, I wish I could put my TikTok up, but it's acting weird, bruh. And her walk, that's another thing. Her signature walk is crazy. When she be walking, she be slaying, bruh, seriously. Look at that. I don't know who that is. I don't know who that... I don't know who that is screaming. <laughs> but they're me inside. <laughs> but they are me inside. Knees like Marianne. She better walk. Look. She be walking. Yeah, that gown was superb. I want to find a scene where they walk in together, though. Because the joint when they actually walk... Oh, is this it? No. When... Oh, here it is. When they arrived. Look at this shit here. They look really good. Can't wait for the series. I can't wait for the series either. It's going to be good. Look at how they just... Look like king and queen, bruh. And she got her angel. That's Tina. So the chick, the chick with the angel wings on that side, you know Heidi, the one that played, um, uh, uh, the the one that played the chick. Uh, what was her name on Gap, y'all? What was her name on Gap? What was Heidi's name, y'all? On the Gap series. Oh, what was her name? Mina? No, what was it? Nita. Thank you, Nita. Nita, Nita, Nita. Thank you, y'all. Heidi played Nita. Heidi is in this pack. This is how I ended up here. Because I went and started stalking Heidi's fine ass. And I found out that she's got like a ship with the one with the wings on, Tina. But they, I don't think that they've actually done anything. I think that they both have the same kind of energy. Because y'all think that, yeah, well, I can't even get my words together. The energy that Nita was giving off in them little calm, quiet scenes. Let me explain something to you. The real Heidi, the woman that actually plays Nita. Bro, she's actually like that, but on a more hyper level. 
I'm talking about hypersexual. Like she's kind of like an uh, ink file where like everybody around her be uh, falling in love with her too. But Nita is a whole. Uh, Nita is a, who said Yuki. <laughs> Nita is a, I mean, Heidi is a whole problem. Her and old girl, they got, bruh, they shit, okay? But they a whole package deal, bro. I, how could I not, how could I not, bruh? I wonder, where's the scene where all three of them are walking the stage together? Is that in this? Because that scene was hard, too. They was walking, walking. The three of them, I don't know if they got it in this one, but the three of them was walking the stage together. It don't look like it's in this one. But the three of them was walking the stage together. But I gotta show y'all, I gotta show y'all Heidi, the one that actually played Nita. Y'all gotta see, y'all, y'all gotta see Heidi's energy, bro, with this other chick, Tina. She is off the mother freaking chain. Let's go back to the favorites. Let's go back to the favorites. And where is it? It's right here. Look at this. I'm about to. So this is Heidi and Tina, right? Look at these two here. Look, 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 look at, look, look, I'm gonna just show you, first I'm gonna just show you this part here. Look, look at this shit here. That's how they, and I'm telling you, this is how they always are. This is how they always are. Look, hold on. This is how they always are. Now look, now watch this scene. Watch, watch, watch this shit him. Now they supposed to be selling some uh, some kind of product. I want you to watch them. They're supposed to be selling a product. This is Heidi and Tina. So Nita and Tina. Look, look at this. Nothing yet. I don't know if that music is copyrighted, but what look at this this part right here. Let, let me be more of a creep for y'all. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Because y'all know I can take it to the uh, ultimate level. Let me be more of a creep for y'all. I'ma slow it down. Watch this. Watch this. Watch Tina's. Look at how. Look how. Um, look at the pause. Look at the pausation. Look at how Heidi's looking at her. Why is she looking at her like a nigga? Like, like she want to pull it. Look. Okay. Nah. Uh. Right. That's what I said. They worse than Free and Becky. Bro, when I said, but the crazy thing about it is, Freen and Becky, real relationship, if you didn't know, uh, Ingfa and Charlotte, I don't care what nobody says, real relationship. Now it is, it wasn't in the beginning, but it is now. Um, like I said, something happened after Indonesia. These two, I don't think these two have ever actually done anything. I think they're legitimately friends. But see, the thing about it is, Tina got the same energy as Heidi. Tina and Heidi have the same energy, proof being right here on this next scene. Look at this. First of all, they also, and I love Thai TV television, you know they let them get drunk. They legitimately let them get drunk on TV. Like, they be giving them alcohol, wine, and shit. Look at Heidi. She's she's going down, bro. Look, she's lit, bro. Look. Watch her go. Watch her fall back. But she's holding on to the, she holding on to the, uh. <laughs> she said, I got to sit down, bro. She said, I got to sit down, bro. They bumping cookies, friends. They not, though. I'm trying to tell you. They're not though. They're not though. I don't think that these two have actually ever done anything. I don't think these two have actually ever done anything. But the lady that's sitting there with the blue dress on, she's the owner of the company. She's out here selling their products. And what they do is they hire, you know, beauty queens and, and like singers and actresses and actors to come and just, you know, be a face, be a sponsor on their show while they do this. And they do like, they do it live. That's the crazy thing. They really be taking risks because they do this live and they be getting people drunk. They be cursing on Thai television and everything. They don't have, America's censorship is so whack, bro. They don't have censorship like that overseas. 
Look, look at this. Now watch this scene right here. Look at this. I'm not playing with them. Look at this. Look how Tina looks at. Y'all see? They are real friends. Yeah, these two are just friends. I know you say you never met such friends, but trust me, these two are just friends. You know how I know? Because this is why I know that they're just friends. Because they're so comfortable acting like this. Remember when Easy and Natalie got into that weird phase where they both was feeling each other and they started acting real weird about uh, about them being best friends and they kept overemphasizing, we're just friends, we're just friends, we're just friends. That's exactly what Ingfa and Charlotte and Freen and Becky do. These two don't do that. These two be all up in each other's faces, like, mwah, 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 like doing all that playful stuff. That's how I know that they haven't done anything because all their energy is still right here. It's when you get awkward out in public that I know you're doing something in private. Tell me I'm lying. No, it's not that I don't think Freen and Becky are real. Freen and Becky are real. Are you serious? Y'all got to go on TikTok. Y'all got to go on TikTok. Freen and Becky are legit. If you don't know, if you don't know that Freen and Becky, the two women that do the Gap series, if you don't know that they're legitimately a couple, you haven't gone down the rabbit hole I went down. Come on now, right? I better preach. Right. That's a great point. I'm trying to tell y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all. When they act like this in public, they not doing nothing behind closed doors because all the energy is in public. I promise you. But when they act awkward or when somebody catch them staring and they be pulling their hands away or when they be acting different or like I say how Easy and Natalie was like overemphasizing and overplaying the best friend card. That's just my BFF. We can do couple things, but we're just BFFs. That's how Ingla acts and that's how Freen Becky acts. Hyena don't act like that. All their energy is right here. I promise you. You said I'm in the rap. Thank you, everybody that's in the rabbit hole with me. I stay watching them. Thank you. No, I just wanted to know what, the, uh, what you thought. Thank you. I don't have TikTok. It's okay, baby. If you don't have TikTok, you got YouTube. Type in Inglot. Type in Hyena. Type in Freen Becky on YouTube. Matter of fact, you want to see? Y'all want to know how I know that Freen Becky, that um, Freen and Becky are uh, a real couple? I got you. Oh, I got you. I'm already ready for that one too. Let's go. <laughs> y'all already know. I'm I'm ready for that. I saved all these videos so that I could take y'all down this rabbit hole with me. Let's do it. Y'all ready? So this was them just a couple days ago. A couple days ago, they did a Valentine's special. This is them doing the same thing that the other two girls was doing. They selling a product. Um, uh, This one is a vitamin C joint. Watch this. You said check your IG chats. Baby, how much? I can't check my IG chats. You know, you know, you just showed me. If I check my IG chats, I'm not going to see what y'all saying here. This the video for me. See? This, come on. This is the video, right? This is the one. We need to go down the rabbit. We need down the rabbit hole merch. Y'all want down the rabbit hole merch? If y'all want down the rabbit hole merch, can I see some rabbit emojis in the, in the comments? If y'all want down the rabbit hole merch, let me see some rabbit hole. Because uh, if you want it, I'll design it tonight. Y'all know I'll be playing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. SR, this confirmed it, right? Anybody that was following Freen and Becky... If you thought that they were just, because you know, they like to call it in Thailand, they call it a skinship. Basically, it's like when they're real good friends or real close friends, but they like to touch all the time, they call it a skinship. I think that Heidi and Tina, right, the one that played Nita and her friend, I think that they legitimately, bet, I got y'all, rabbit hole merch coming. I think that they are legitimately a skinship, meaning that even though they're really playful and they're sexually playful, they have never done anything. They just like to hold and touch each other and flirt and do all those kinds of things, right? They're very comfortable with each other. Freen and Becky. And here's the thing. Freen and Becky, in my opinion, are more obvious than Ingfa and Charlotte. And that's mainly because of Charlotte. If, if Charlotte, because both Becky and Freen have been very open about the fact that they're bisexual. Um, Charlotte wasn't ne necessarily open about it. I, I can show y'all the live where they first had the conversation and Ingfa asked her, she said, hey, she said, are you in the LGBTQ? And she was like, sort of, kind of. She said, I'll date anybody I'm comfortable with, but I never dated a girl. So even though she's like open to dating women, uh, before Ingfa, Charlotte has never messed with any, uh, with a woman. You know what I'm saying? She's never messed with a woman. These two right here, if you thought, if you didn't think that these two were a couple, I'm going to just let this play. This is a minute and 15 seconds. I'm going to just let this play. This is the one right here. This is what did it for me. <laughs> so the game they're playing right now is, the game they're playing right now is you got to guess the word, right? And this one, I think it was jealous. 
So Becky says, it's my habit. And then watch what she, just just watch, just watch. Hold on. Just go. Hold on. I love when Freen speaks English. I love when Freen speaks English. If you didn't know, obviously, Becky is half British. So when she speaks English, she speaks English very well and she speaks it with a British accent. When Freen speaks English, it's so adorable. <laughs> Cause she has such a strong accent. It's so adorable, bro. You can't see the y'all can't see the subtitles. I can't. So the thing about it is the subtitles. I didn't do the subtitles. This video actually doesn't have subtitles. It's really small. Y'all want me to run it back and so that y'all can see? Yeah, it was the candy part. I thought the candy part was on. Oh, it is. That's what I was waiting for. I'm. It's getting to the candy part. Hold on. The candy part is what it did. Is what did it. Yeah, Charlotte is half British too. Yup. Charlotte is half British too. I'm gonna need a shout out when you get when you drop the merch. I got you, Shasha. I got you. <laughs> no, no, no. This part right here. So for those who can't see the comments, for those who can't see the comments, this next word was um. All right, hold on. This next word it says want attention and snuggle. That's what it says. Now the only clue that Becky is going to give to uh, Freen is all she's going to say is Nong Beck, which basically just means me. Like, you know, younger Nong and uh, uh, I forget what the P stands for. But when you hear them say um, N Becky or P Fa or P Freen, the reason why they call her P Freen is because she's older than Becky. So it's like a nickname thing over there. I, I can get into the specifics of it because I know all of it, but I'm not going to bore you with the details. The point is the only clue that Becky gives to snuggle or cuddle or want attention is she says her name because she wasn't done with her explanation she just started by saying her name watch what <laughs> watch the responses that freen gives to her thinking that the clue is becky she she thinks that the clue is becky saying her name she thinks that's the only clue watch her responses she says no i'm back and she says darling now I don't know if y'all know in American culture it's not it doesn't translate if you don't understand Thai culture. Like I said, my um my my sister-in-law basically uh is or my my uh I call her my sister because her and my brother are not together anymore, but she's still my sister and we're still very close friends, and he and her are good friends. Um so I call her my sister-in-law. But she's Thai. When I tell you that darling is not something that you just throw around, like darling is like how we say bae. Like how you're not gonna just go around and call everybody bae. They don't just go around and call everybody darling. So she said, so when uh, Becky said Nong Beck, or when she said she said her name, and Freen's response was to guess the word was darling. That's why I watch Becky's response. Becky's going to be like, like, what did you just do? Why? Just watch. <laughs> Becky's like, no. And then Freen goes, am I right? And Becky says, no. She said, what did you, and then, and then Freen said, what did you say? <laughs> Look, and Freen is low-key already embarrassed because she's she accidentally said darling. Just watch, just watch. I don't know. She said what? Now, now Becky playing because now Becky's only saying Nong Beck. Now she says, oh, younger sister. She tries to clear it up, right? She says younger sister, but then she says no. And then she goes, love her. Love her? And yes, lover in Thai means the same as it does in English. Yes. P is older, sister Nong is younger. Exactly. Thank you for breaking that down for me, Whitney. I didn't want to take the time to explain it, but yeah. P means older and uh, Nong means younger. Um, and, oop, let me sit my kombucha and mom. I've been right. The reaction is priceless. She was just like, she was, bro, she was exposing the hell out of them. Freen was, I mean. Becky was like, nah. So she goes, no, she says her name and Becky and first friend says darling then she goes no she says then she says younger sister then she goes no so then she goes love her girl what I don't love no sister like that and then Becky goes gives her another clue I like to do this with you 
when I'm tired. I come to you like a cat and I snuggle. And then she goes, and then she guesses it and says snuggle. I'm tired of them. <laughs> so we just telling, telling. Literally expose themselves. Oh, that didn't have a candy part. Let me get the candy. Where's the candy? Oh, here's the candy part. So here's the candy part of that same interview. This is the candy part. This is what, um, was it? who said that? It was the candy part that did it for you. They dry snitching on themselves. Girl, that was that even dry snitching? That wasn't dry snitching. That was wet as hell. Look at this shit here. I had to cut that because I don't know if it's copyrighted. Look, 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 look. This is this part right here. So this part with Freem was crazy because they had they had like these long ass sour straws. Freem broke the shit smaller on purpose. And <laughs> she broke it smaller. It was like, and then and when she got and she gave a look that was like, hold on, you'll see. She gave a look like, uh, cause this is just the intro. She gave a look like, look, Freem making it shorter. Becky was looking at her like, what are you doing? Literally, Becky looked at her like, what are you doing? She broke that shit. Look how Becky looking at her. Look how, now look how Freem looks. Like, yeah. <laughs> yo, Freem, yo, Freem, star, that's right. You was the one that said it. Look at Freem. Becky said, look, <laughs> Becky said, girl, what you doing? Look, she, look at Becky. Becky was like, what are you? <laughs> And Freem knew what she was doing, bro. Freem said, watch this. Look at how Freem looking. She got the devil in her, bro. She knew she was about to do some devious shit. Look. Everybody say, look at her face here. Look. Becky even said, she was like, it's too short. Freem was like, nah. But look at how her knee is bouncing, y'all. That nervous energy, her knee was bouncing like crazy the whole time. Everybody that saw that joint know what I'm talking about. Freem leg was bouncing like crazy. And if you ever seen them do their like their live reactions to their own show, the, to the Gap series, Freem actually, they both have a hard time. But I feel like I see it in Freem more. There are times, because I feel like Freem is extremely affectionate. Freem be wanting to reach out to her and she be like, and she like remembers and she has to like maintain her self-control. It's crazy. It's crazy. Freem is definitely with the shits. Her head was cocked hella hard, bruh. <laughs> Said the nerves were through to through the roof on this joint. Her leg was bouncing like her joint was bouncing like this. I hope I can. I, I don't know if they got it zoomed out. I have it zoomed out, but it's like a long version of it. But the way her leg was bouncing, look. Okay, there you go. Look, look at how her leg is bouncing the whole time. That's some nervous energy for that ass. And then look, Becky said, oh, you think you, look, now I'm trying to tell y'all, in real life, somebody said it already, in real life, Becky is Sam. Well, I'm trying, trust me, in real life, Freen does have daddy energy sometimes in the way she dresses and carries herself, but in their relationship, I'm trying to tell y'all, Becky is like daddy, bro, like she really, <laughs> watch Becky's face throughout this joint, watch, just, just watch how Becky literally like, oh, anything you can do, I can do better. I can do anything better than you. Because Becky not going to pull the... Uh, Freem pulled up the pillow and covered them. Watch how Becky carries it. She look, She picked up that long joint. And then she put them up. Look, look, she got the long joint. She put that joint down. And she said... She said, nah. She said, I'm going to do this one. She said, watch this. But don't 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 get it twisted. Y'all saw Freem point at the shorter one too, though. Freem literally pointed at the shorter joint and was like, yeah, do that one. And then Becky, she was like, do this one. Becky said, no, I'm going to choose this one. And so she went for an even shorter one. Look. Look at that. Now, how are they supposed to do this without their lips touching? Becky knew. Watch Becky's face. Becky's with the shits. Becky like, come on. Look at Freem. <laughs> Look at Freem. Becky just don't care sometimes. She really doesn't. Becky, and I think that's her youth. Becky really just don't care. Because Becky's only like 20. She really doesn't care. She got dumb shy. Freen got dumb shy. Look at Becky like, come on, look. Becky like, come here. <laughs> Freen was still just like. <laughs> Becky wanted more. I'm trying, look, y'all remember the scene? Y'all remember the scene when Becky topped mine in episode nine? Y'all remember that? Y'all remember that? 
that come get it right that come get it that come get it hella look you say you keep rewinding the can't keep up <laughs> that come get it though that was a hundred percent that come get it energy bro i'm trying to tell you i'm trying to tell you they was a mess this whole live yo it was a whole hour of them just trying to and then and then freem was like let me drink this water so don't know my, don't nobody realize that i almost lost my freem really be getting her uh becky really be getting freem like all of twitter so to speak uh she really be getting her up there yo her pupil, yes, her pupils were blown in that scene. That's because that was top Becky vibes. That was not Mon no more, bro. That was Becky. That was Becky. Freen had to literally push her off. She was like, yo, you gotta relax. She said when art translates to life, yeah. She was like, yo, she was like, yo, you got y'all remember that, right? Y'all don't make me pull it up. Oh, let me okay, let me take a poll in the um comment in the comments right now. Out of the four love scenes, because there was four love scenes, if you didn't know, and we said episode eight. Episode nine, there were two. It was the one on the couch, and then it was the one in the office. First of all, I would also like to state that the out of four love scenes, they only made love in the bed once. They do they, they love themselves some damn couches, okay? They love couches. But out of the four love scenes, so you got episode eight, episode nine couch, episode nine office, or episode 11. Which one? Go. Which one? My favorite is the office. The office. Who said that? Call me, uh, they call me, uh, four, oh, four, uh, okay. <laughs> call me. <laughs> What's your real name, baby? I'm looking forward to watching this all. Yo, look. Episode nine off. Th this is why my creep nation is my creep nation. My solicit nation is my solicit nation. Y'all are creeps just like me. I knew that y'all was going to pick the same one as me. I knew y'all was going to pick the same one as me because that scene, especially when Freem was doing what she was doing from behind and she had the choke on Becky and Becky was just like. Yeah, the most recent one came with too much trauma attached to it. It really did. It was sweet, but I was like everything around it was just, it was like too much. But I love us too. I love us too, man. I really love us. That don't resist me joint. That's what I'm saying. When she put her hand on it, y'all want me to play that scene real quick? Don't get me started. Y'all want me to bring I'll bring it up now. Don't get me. Don't, look, don't tempt me with a good time. But Becky's the freak, bro. Becky is the true freak. I'm trying to tell you. Everything went down in that office. The office is a tough one to go up against. But Mon Toppin is close to it. Mon Toppin was... Look, y'all know how I felt about that. Especially when that piano kicked in. I was like, God, because I was imagining that uh, that was... <laughs> you said, do it. You said, play it. Y'all go... You want me to do it? I ain't gonna... You want me to do it? We in this together? If we in this together, y'all tell me we in this together. We gonna do this? All right, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Hold on, let me see. I'm gonna let this play. Let me let me let me let this finish. Poor friend. Becky be having her. Becky be having her feeling some type of way. I'm trying to tell you. She know. Look how she's looking at her. She looking like I'm a. She's like I'm gonna tear that up when we get. <laughs> I'm sorry. I took it too far. Did I take it too far? Did I take it too far? We in this together? Yeah. She said, I'm a, she, look, she said, I'm going to tear this up when we get home. She said, I'm just letting you know for the record, I'm going to tear this up when we get home. Now, they are still to this day claiming that they're just sisters. I'm talking about Infa and Charlotte. Watch this live. I'm not even going to give no context for the live. Just watch this live and y'all tell me what y'all think. Y'all, I want y'all to tell me in the comments, as you're watching it, I want you to write friend or I want you to write lover. In the comments, write friend or lover as we watch this. Just watch. So they did a mock, it's like a mock wedding. It's the, uh, the, uh, the sponsor that they went to, uh, to like sell the product. They did like a mock wedding for them. So these are just like some snip. This is just going to be like snippets of that. You, I, it ain't even started yet. Y'all already talking about lovers. <laughs> wait a minute. Let it get into it. Don't even need to watch it. No, just wait. Oh, can y'all see the subtitles? Before I, like, let me know. Can y'all see the subtitles? Okay. Oh, wait. I should go back and make the screen bigger. So y'all can really actually see it. Because they all, I know y'all saw what Becky did. What a little nasty. So. All right. All right. Is that better? Is that better, y'all? 
You said sister premium? Yeah, right, exactly. This is the premium package. So, I'm not gonna say nothing. All right, cool bet. <laughs> So she she already put that joint in her mouth. She was like, let me wash it off and give it to you. As if water would really actually wash away those germs. Cold water. It wouldn't. Okay, so this is a question that they has to answer. They have to answer. It says, if there's only one hour left, what will you do with your lover for the last time? Now they didn't ask, what would you do with each other? But watch the way that Charlotte responds. They be telling on themselves and they don't even realize they're telling on themselves. Watch the way Charlotte responds to Ingfa's answer. Watch how she responds to Pfa's answer. <laughs> she said, 10 minutes for insurance, 50 minutes left, maybe invited to do something else. Y'all know what she was implying. Charlotte was like, ugh! Like, she... They didn't say she was talking about you. Why are you reacting like she exposing y'all? All they asked is if you was with your lover for the last time, what, or you only had an hour left with your lover, what would you do? She said 10 minutes to make sure all my shit was in order, my paper is in order. She said, and then 50 minutes to do whatever else. You know what I'm saying? They are fine as hell, bro. Look, I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> they are so fine, bro. And then she just asked, and so Fa just asked uh, Shar, she said, in the last situation, she said, who do you want to be with first? And then, so Paolo is um, Shar's pet rabbit. <laughs> rabbit hole, I'm trying to tell you. It was all meant to happen, it was a rabbit hole. She has a pet rabbit. So watch Fa's response to Charlotte's an uh, answer. <laughs> She said, all right, well, then let's say I'm Palo. She said, now what you gonna do? Her answer was very valid. Very valid. I can't wait for that series. It's gonna be crazy. She said, did you ever see, she said, have you ever seen me wrestle my rabbit, basically? Because they got to do to each other what, just watch. <laughs> She said close your but she said close your eyes. She closed her eyes fast as hell, bro. <laughs> right? She closed her eyes fast as hell. Mind you, it's an audience of people sitting right there. So they can't do too much, but if you know them, you know that this is I know it's gonna sound crazy, but this is a lot for them. That's how off that's how standoffish, especially Charlotte is. What you need a pillow for? That's just your sister. What's the pillow for? That's just your sister. Why y'all both acting blushy? I have some And now Kiao is uh Fa's dog. And so she's like, well, if you was my dog, my if you was my my uh, dog, this is what I would do to you. I'm not playing with them. <laughs> Why is she acting so blushy? It's just a kiss, right? It's just a little between sisters. Sisters kiss all the time. Sisters kiss all the time. Now they got a candy moment too. But y'all, their candy moment is crazy. Okay, so this was this question was, I don't know if y'all saw it because it went by so fast. This question was, what have what has either of you done that made the other aware that you saw her as more than a friend? What? Now, in my opinion, Fa's answer, you could be like, okay, I can see how she could see her as more than a friend as a sister. Like, in my opinion, Fa's answer isn't that bad. And as much as, if you watch the whole live, as much as Charlotte did not want to answer this question, in my opinion, Charlotte's answer is way more revealing than Fa's. She said, so basically when she was when she was in the contest for Miss Indonesia, I mean Miss International, Miss Grand International, Charlotte came, flew all the way from Thailand to Indonesia to, you know, a, a bunch of the girls did to support her. And while she was there, she massaging her feet and shit. Now y'all know how I feel about feet. <laughs> you think I'm putting my hands on anybody's foot 
who either didn't give birth to me or I ain't getting in bed with and licking on and doing stuff like that with is giving sneaky freaky. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. All right, bye, DJ Smooth. I love you. See you later, sweetie. Thank you again for my birthday gifts. Shout out to the whole Jackson family. I love y'all. Chemistry, biology, and anatomy. This is what I'm saying. Fly all the way to massage some feet, bruh. This is what I'm saying. Who's doing this? They are. But like I said, granted, even still, even still, some sisters, I can see. Oh, excuse me. Burped on you guys. Even still, I can see. I can see how that could be some sister stuff, right? Now, if I'm massaging your feet, we married for life. <laughs> Shasha said, I ain't rubbing on nobody damn feet that I ain't married to. All right, so now watch Charlotte's answer. In my opinion, Charlotte's answer is more boyfriend, girlfriend, 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 boyfriend, boyfriend type shit. Look. <laughs> she told me something, that's all. We didn't do nothing. That's it. That's all. Look at Charlotte. But you know what's crazy? All of these lovey dovey scenes aren't even the ones to me that did the uh that told me that they were together. I'ma show y'all I'm gonna show y'all what really told me they were together. And it's in this clip. It's so slight that if you was there or if you watched the whole live and you wasn't paying attention, you would have missed it. But I'm gonna show y'all something for real. But look. Right, you love your sis, but not that much. This is what I'm saying, blue. <laughs> So if y'all didn't catch it because it went kind of quick, she's basically saying like at the beginning um, or at uh, Indonesia again, I'm trying to tell y'all, bro. I think this incident happened after Indonesia too. She said that they all went out, like a group of them all went out as friends, right? And she's saying it was some of Fa's friends and some of her friends. And then it was like some of their mutual friends. And then um, Fa's sister. And so that's what she's saying. That, that's basically, I just want to get make sure y'all understood. So she's telling, this is the story that Charlotte is telling. This is how she knew that Fa looked at her as more than a friend. Look her trying not to <laughs> smile. <laughs> So basically what she's saying is Fi would like Fi was like they was walking into like this bar or whatever restaurant. Fi basically they was a whole group of them, right? They all walking together, they all friends. She's the one that Fa looked back, grabbed her hand, and led her into the joint. And that, I, in my opinion, I feel like, again, that says more about Charlotte than it does about Fa. Because technically, you could grab your friend's hand and lead them into a restaurant or a bar, even if it's a group of y'all, right? It's the way Charlotte saw that as, damn, she treated me like I'm her woman. Charlotte's eyes are mad captivating. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Charlotte's everything is captivating. <laughs> just for the record. Touching feet is very intimate. I'm trying, bro, ain't nobody running around just touching people's feet, bro. Unless you paid to do that. And even then. You got to get the vid with the gold dresses where Charlotte was dancing. Oh, that's a good one. I got you. Look, look, look. So, friends and lovers. Friends and lovers, tell me before it gets to the next part, because the next part to me is really going to tell the, is going to tell the truth. <laughs> Friends and lovers, y'all, tell me. Lovers, okay. Lovers, okay. Look at how she said. Look at how they acting after the answer. <laughs> if you blush about that, you want me to be your. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> lovers. Period. They took a break after that scene to get the job done. Okay, so here's the candy scene. Here's their candy scene. You thought Becky and Freeze joint was crazy? Watch this shit here. Watch this shit here. Lil John, Lil John said it back right. Just watch. I know y'all like Nikki. That doesn't mean anything. I want y'all to notice, look where Charlotte's uh, elbow is bent up. You see where that black thing is? You see the little white thing? That's the candy. 
So the candy actually fell out, but they had kept going. What was you what was you chewing on? What what was they chewing on? The candy fell. This is the candy fell. Watch this. Candy's falling. They still going. The candy fell. And I think somebody they show it from the other side too, if you don't believe me. She didn't oh, and in the real live there was more time in between. Like this is really this is clipped down. But right, jaw movements, right, exactly. It's a sucking candy. Like, what is your jaw doing all that for? Look, straight scooping. Look, when um you couldn't really see this, but in the original joint, which is much longer, obviously, and all it's not edited down like this, it's like an hour long. She, Charlotte literally didn't want to take the mask off. Like, Ingfa had to take it off for her. That's how embarrassed she was. That's how I know they really kissed. You can hear it in the mic. What? I didn't hear that. You know, she did a little smirk and reacted. Hmm. So it's like I said, Fa's birthday is coming up. She leaned down for a kiss. Oh, and by the way, cheek kisses and forehead kisses in Thai culture are extremely intimate. Do I have anybody in here from Thailand that can confirm that? Cheek kisses, like how we just be giving cheek kisses out, or like how they do in France, it's like a double cheek kiss. Nah, in Thailand, a cheek kiss is a very intimate thing, and a forehead kiss is even more intimate. Yeah? Y'all not talking to me. Okay, not talking to me. They made them cut. This, by the way, that's not a real cake. It didn't even cut. It was like cardboard or something. It'd be the other way around in real life. Look. Look. But that's not the scene. I'm tr I'm le I'm finna let y'all. Is, is it coming? This is the scene coming up. This is how you know they're together. They are FaceTiming somebody. I don't know who it is, but they're FaceTiming someone. Charlotte says they in response to whatever the girl says, she goes, awesome. Fa goes, do you have a boyfriend? Watch what Charlotte does. I was told that um Thailand forehead kisses are reserved for darlings. Facts. They are. Cheek kisses too, though. Don't look. Cheek kisses are extremely intimate. Cheek kisses are not something they just be giving out. You know what I'm saying? Like some people do it, but it for the most part, cheek kisses are reserved for like your most um intimate partner. But watch this. So Charlotte says in response, awesome to whatever the girl, whoever the girl is on the um, phone. Fa goes, do you have a boyfriend? Watch how Charlotte responds. Did y'all see that? Did y'all see that? When she, did y'all see her? Did y'all see her shoulder check her? Like, why the fuck you asking her that when I'm sitting right here? Did you see her shoulder check her? Like, why are you, yo, and even when she first asked it, you see her smile disappear, but because she's a professional, her smile disappeared, but real quick, she smiled again. That nudge like, bitch, don't play facts, Lex. That nudge was like, that nudge was like, get, get beat up on camera. Get beat up on camera. That, that nudge was like, get beat up on camera. That's all I had to see. We didn't, look, we didn't have to watch none of the other stuff leading up to that. And if I saw that, I would have been like, why is a friend nudging her? About like why would you care if she's asking this girl, not the black mama above show check like just <laughs> she fat she. What you asking that for? I was like, bruh, stop playing. And watch her smile disappear. And then she brought it back like, oh okay. And then she was like, <laughs> and Fago gonna go on to try to explain it. Look, she knew she was in trouble. She start then she start packing her shit up like, all right, time to go. She was like, this live is over now. You look. I was like, oh shit. She knew she was in trouble. Look at her trying to explain it away. She like, nah, cause you cause cause you know how like <laughs> That's somebody who's in trouble and they know they're in trouble. That's somebody who's in trouble and they know they're in trouble, bro. You said run it back. Look, that's a, look, all right, I'll run it back one more time. That's somebody who's in trouble and knows they're in trouble. She hit her with the shoulder check. Look at this. Look at this him. Me 
Becky getting jealous over Freen? Oh, yeah. I feel like Freen is scarier than Becky, though, when she's jealous. Freen don't play. Charlotte was definitely like, I'm going to take care of this bag. She's like, when we get in, that, when we get in the car. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm trying to explain it like nah it's cause what I meant to see what had happened was didn't even make no sense didn't even make sense look her <laughs> nah Becky a boxer bro yeah if you didn't know that Becky's a uh, she she takes movie time she does Thai boxing um she don't be playing but yeah this joint right here no when I say that Freen is scary or jealous it's because of the way that she reacts Becky is scary in the sense that, like, she could probably actually whoop somebody's ass. <laughs> like, because she's a Thai boxer. And I know y'all probably, some of y'all that don't know that, right? Becky? Mom? Yes, she boxes. But, um, Freen don't care where they are. They will be in an audience, an auditorium full of people. And the people that they're on stage with, like, they're castmates. There was one time when the girl that plays Jim, Pinam, she went to reach for Becky's hand. Like they were just up on stage singing. Freen is literally singing. And they went to, and she and they were just gonna hold hands as friends, uh, Becky and um Pinam. And Freen slapped Pinam's hand away, bruh. It, yo, she literally she slapped her hand away, like, what the fuck you doing? Like, no, we don't do that here. Becky's strongest right. When Freen slapped the girl's hand, yes. Freen will answer the fans like chill. She sure will. There was one time when they asked Freen, when they asked Becky, they was doing a little meet and greet. And they asked Becky, they was on stage, and they were like, um, do you have a girlfriend or do you just have a mommy slash honey? And that's basically based, that's what she be calling um, Freen, and it's like a friend name or whatever. And she goes, and Becky says, no, I don't have a girlfriend. The way that Freen looked at her like, bitch, you don't? Like, I'm not standing right here? And I mean, she gave her daggers. Like, it wasn't even like, <laughs> it was like she was dead ass serious. Like, like they're... They're trying to play it all. It's like Freen be forgetting that they're supposed to not be telling anybody. What's up, Art? Uh, what's up, Lisa? Thank you for becoming a uh, solicit elite member. I appreciate you, sweetheart. Pinon tried to hug Becky and Freen shoved her. Yes. Becky got into it with a fan. Yup. Hey, yo, find that video, please. Which one? Which one? Thank you, Treasure. Thank you so much for the um donation, love. I thank you for the gift. I appreciate you, sweetheart. What's that clip? Which one? Which clip y'all asking me about? Fine, which one? That's cool, Lisa. I knew you was coming, baby. Gotta head out, loves. Bye, Melanie. I love you. Appreciate you. Where Becky says she doesn't have a girl. Oh, got you. Damn. I gotta find that shit. Hold on, I got you. But real quick, this part, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, fin I'm gonna let this finish up. Uh, Charlotte right here, you see how she's bowing to uh, Fa? Watch what she says as her reason for bowing. Now, mind you, this is supposed to be a mock wedding day, right? This is supposed to be a dang D gifted five memberships. Go ahead. Go ahead, man. Lex, I think you the only um moderator in here now. Hold on. All right, so real quick, I'm gonna finish this one up and then I'm gonna go find that. I'm gonna go find that joint. I probably I'm gonna go find that uh that scene when um Becky said she didn't have a girlfriend and Freen looked at her like, don't get beat up on this stage. Freen looked <laughs> They, they both had on little black dresses. Freen said, thank you, Kimitria. Thank you. Thank you so much for becoming an elite member. I appreciate you, sweetheart. Yup. Unless I remove y'all, y'all always going to be um, moderators. Um. All right. So, like I said, Charlotte is bowing to her. Remember, this is supposed to be a mock wedding day. So, listen to what Charlotte says to uh, the crowd. She said, pay, she said, I'm, she's, this, sometimes the translation kind of gets lost in translation, but this, this is what she basically said. She said, I'm paying respect to my husband before we enter the honeymoon suite, basically, before we go to the marriage bed. That's why Fa looked at her like, girl, what'd you just say? Charlotte, because really, it's not Fa holding them back. It's not Fa holding them back. It's Charlotte, because again, like, you know, she's new to it and, and Fa don't want to like rush her. So she just kind of lets her run the show basically so like whatever she reveals she lets it she don't care she lets her reveal it but it's really charlotte lately that has been more like uh carefree and careless bro but look watch five i'm like girl what you just say she said not you telling them not you telling them right yo right Sharby playing 
Of course, Winnie. I appreciate you. I feel honored that you guys are my moderators, man. I appreciate you guys. Yeah, Charlotte don't care anymore. She does, Khalifa, she don't. She does not, bro. And I love that for them. Because i been waiting, bro. If you go back, it's been almost a year now. It's been like 10 months. I think in February it became 10 months. Fa has been playing the long game. She really has. She's been playing the long game. She's been playing the long game. You said, please, I need a membership also. Jay Quellen says she need a membership, y'all. Can somebody give her a membership? Okay, Charlotte Wright. Look, Charlotte was ready for war. She was like, that's my baby. All right, real quick. Y'all said find the, um, hold on. Uh, jealous, not jelly. Uh, jealous Freen and Becky. All right, let me see if I can find that joint off break. Let me see if I can find it off break. Break, 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 break. Let me see if I can find it off break. Oh my God, where is it? Hey. Where is it? Nah, not that one. Uh, oh, there it is. Booyaka. This joint right here. <laughs> so that was je that was Becky being jealous of uh, uh she stepped in front of a uh, Freen and a um and a fan. But watch Freen, bro. I think that jealous Becky being jealous is like okay. But Freen being jealous is le legitimately scary. Hold on, let's get into that part. Hold on, I'm gonna just get to, let me see if I can, I can just, I know exactly where it is, hold on. Becky thought fans wanted to flirt with Freem, blah, blah, blah. I know exactly what part it's at, hold on. Yeah. Oh, yep, yep, here it is, here it is. You see, look, look, look. What that joke say is I'm hovering over, it's a most replayed part. <laughs> it's a most replayed part because everybody knows that this part right here, So that's that part right there was crazy too, cause Becky was like, um, somebody was like, "Can I flirt on you?" And Becky at first thought that they were trying to flirt with Freen, and she was like, "Who? Like who the hell you? Like who you want to flirt with?" And then she was like, "Me. Watch this." Somebody said she can box. Be careful. <laughs> they said she can box. Freen like that. Thompson's so aggressive. I'm, she. For, I, that's what I'm trying to tell y'all. Freen likes top Becky. She likes the aggressive Becky. She does. She loves that shit, bro. Hold on. What do you say? I suppose so. What happened? All right, Lex. We cool either way. Hold on. What happened? Got to ease them. Got to ease them into that life. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've been trying to figure out how to do it all stream. Do what? Wait, wait, wait. Do what? Ease them in like with a little tenderness. Do what? What y'all talking about? Do you know the clip when Becky was playing and a hand game with the Yo, I saw that clip when Becky was playing a hand game with the audience member and <laughs> Free literally took the audience, took the fans' hands. Like, that's like, she looked at her like, bitch, what you doing? Like, Free, that's what I'm trying to tell y'all. Free to me is scarier than Becky when she's jealous because Becky, she says stuff and she's, you know, she steps in the way, but Becky already knows she could probably whoop all their ass. And so Becky don't be like, she be like, I ain't concerned. I got, I know my spot. Free legitimately is like possessive of Becky. She's like, she's like, no. When, like when Sam said in the scene and they first time, when they first made love, when she was like, you belong to me now. I think that was, that was free. <laughs> okay. Now watch this. They asked to hit on you. Thank you, Linda. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you, D, for gifting another friendship. Thank you. I mean, membership. Hold on. Where did it go? Oh, wait a minute. That wasn't it. Calm down, Becky. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is it this one? Damn, where is it at, bro? I want, I'm trying to get to that specific part, man. Oh, are they going to go back outside? Because where is it at? Oh, wait. Is it this part? No, nope, that's not that. Oh, here it is. Is this it? Yeah. 
Oh, they play me, y'all. Oh, wait. They played me. Why did they didn't, why didn't show that part? That's whack, bro. What? I hate when they do that, when they get some parts and don't get all of them. Because that wasn't it. Damn. That wasn't it, bro. Hold on. That makes me mad. That wasn't it. That's not the part I was talking about. Now I don't know how I'm going to find it because I don't actually know where... Uh, I know where I saw... I know I saw it here, but... I know I saw it on YouTube, but... See, this is what happened. You type in Jealous Friend. Look at all this Inglot shit that pops up. This is how I got caught up in the Inglot trap. That's how that happened, y'all. Just for the record. Where is it at, man? Oh, that's terrible! It was that exact same... It was that... Why they didn't put that in there? I hate when they do that, bruh. Like, why wouldn't you just show all of it? You know what I mean? Like... Damn it. Child, what are they talking about? I don't even know who these people are anymore. Like... Well, that's unfortunate. I, I'm sorry, y'all. I, I can't find it. it that's it, that's unfortunate. Um, we ain't gonna find it. That's fine. Yeah, I can't find it. But I swear, if y'all, you will come across it. You will. I promise you, you will come across it because, um, Freen is like dumb jealous. Oh, here, let me see if this one got the. Um, I want to see if this one got the one where she slapped the uh, where she took the her uh, the fans' hands away from Becky. That shit was hilarious to me. I know exactly what that one looked like. No, 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 nope, that's not it. Damn. Jealous freeing moments. Hold on, let me see. Where is that joint at? Where she, um... Oh, that's so irritating, man. I don't know where that joint at, bruh. It's so funny because you can always find stuff when you're not looking for it. But the moment you be like, I really need to find this, that should be going into Narnia. You be like, now where the hell is that? Where the hell did it go? Where the hell did it go? Look, this is another jealous moment. Well, it's not even jealous. It's just, just this just shows how possessive Freen is. Come on, man. Y'all be the music is crazy. Ain't nobody else touching. She got her hand on this girl back. Like, leave her alone. <laughs> leave her alone, Freem. Freem versus Becky Jealous. Is that what I should type in? We still going? Yeah. Choosing this live over sleep. Oh, Yama. Oh, my goodness. Is it is it time for you to go to bed, baby? Don't stay up. I'm going to say it alive. I promise I'm going to say it alive. Did you watch the Madam Finn live where Ingfa was drinking too much? <gasps> I don't know if they're ready for that, though. I don't know if they're ready for that version of Ingfa. Because I really want y'all to get to know Ingfa before y'all see that version of Ingfa. Because y'all gonna really think that's who Ingfa is. But I'm gonna do it anyway. Yes, please. Everybody remember to hit the like button. Please hit the like button. Please, please, please hit the like buttons. Be at the point of no return, bro. Hold on. You right. Let me go back. Let me go back. Let me see. Let me type in... Freem versus Becky Jealous. It's like all of a sudden I can't find none of the clips we talking about. But y'all, we anybody, everybody that knows what I'm talking about knows that those clips, ex, those clips exist. Um, hold on, hold on, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Stand by. Oh, <gasps> found it! Look. Oh, hold on. I think this is it. Is this it? No. Nope. This ain't it either. I hate them. <laughs> not 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 Becky and them, but I don't like there was I, I don't like that it's not bringing up the clips that I wanted to bring up when I wanted to bring it up, damn it. Look, let me tell you, there was a um wait, what what Khalifa say? Said, did you watch the Madam Fan? No, I, I I did. I did and I got you on that. Hold on, I got you. So there was a um damn it, I just lost my train of thought. There was a there was one where uh Freen, oh, 
there was a lot. Let me tell you, how, this is when I realized how jealous Freen is. I think that Freen is way more jealous than Becky is. Becky gets jealous, but Freen to me, when she, I, I don't think that Freen gets jealous as often as Becky. Actually, no, you know what? They, I think they get jealous right around the same. But this is when I realized how jealous Freen was. There was an episode, an episode, there was a live that Becky was on. She was on live by herself, like on um, Instagram live by herself, right? Um, or it could have been TikTok. And she was saying, she was telling the people in the comments, was like, can we flirt with you? Can we flirt with you? And she literally said, of course y'all can flirt with me. She said, ain't nobody here to stop y'all. That's what she said. She was like, nobody's here. Um, she said, uh, uh, Freen's not here, which is, it's like, why are you bringing her up if that's just your friend? But anyway, she was like, Freen's not here. Nobody's here to stop you. Yeah, y'all can flirt with me. And at first they was like, you serious? And she was like, no, I'm serious. Y'all can flirt with me. So when she said, no, I'm serious, y'all can flirt with me. I lied to you not. She got a notification to for somebody to join her live. <laughs> and it was Freen. Freen came up in that mug and said, who can flirt with you? Dead ass. She came up in that joint and said, who can flirt with you? And um, Becky was like, huh? What you talking about? She was like, the people in the comments are telling on you. She said, "Who? so who's flirting with you? And then Becky was like, oh, no, 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 no. I try to play it off or whatever. And then Freem was like, oh, okay. And then Freem was like, okay, bye. I got to go. And Becky was like, you just going to join my live to leave it? Freem said, I join your live to let them. To, she said, I join your live to claim my place. That was a mess. We had some technical difficulties for a second. Hold on. She peed on, she peed on her on live. Yes, she did. Thank you. She literally marked her territory. She literally marked her territory, bro. She she popped up on that mug. She got on that live. And I mean, when I say she was on that live for like two seconds flat, she was on that live for like two seconds flat. She came up on that joint and then she was like, I'm just here to let these mofos know that I ain't gone nowhere. I was like, no, she didn't. No, she didn't. That, look, look, look. So when y'all see this right here, just know that's both of them. That's both their energy. The way the way she was sitting, uh, Freen was sitting there twerking, and Becky was like, "Yeah, just so y'all know, y'all can look, but that's mine." They both got that energy. But I'm trying to tell y'all, Freen is scarier when she's jealous, bro. She is so much more scarier. All right, now you said bring up the um. I saw I, somebody said bring up the gold dress uh Inglot joint. I got you, I got you. Hold on, I got you, boo boo. See, I got pages saved. You know what I'm saying? What I'm saying? I ain't playing with them. I ain't playing with them. PM Variety. We're going to go right here. Go to videos. I got you. Hold on. Oh, this is another good This is another good moment right here. This was crazy. Watch this moment, y'all. Real quick. I'm gonna show, and then I'm going to get to the, uh, the gold dresses. Look at this joint right here, though. Y'all see this? Daddy back. This is not sister behavior. It's not sister behavior at all, bro. It's not sister behavior at all. I'm glad I clarified before I jumped down that rabbit hole. What rabbit hole? Becky's arm placements and hip thrust. Come on. She, it wasn't a hip thrust. She pulled um, she pulled Freen into her. She pulled Freen into her. You hear me? Mm-hmm. There's a TikTok where they're kissing in a wedding dress. Yeah, a fan threw a wedding for them, like a mock wedding or something like that, to celebrate the end of the series, I believe. What's up, hey? What's up, Kimmy? All right, look, now watch this joint. She said, come closer. Come closer. Come closer to me. All right, watch this. So right now they just chit chatting. They about to start another live, but they just chatting. They're on live right now. They know that, but watch this little moment. <laughs> Did y'all peep that? Cause it went by so fast. It went by so fast. Hold on, let me slow it down. I'm going to show y'all exactly what happened. Let me slow it down so that y'all can really see what happened. Because in real time, you be like, that wasn't nothing, Nikki. Watch. Hold on. Even as a poly woman, a little hint of jealousy sparks the goosies. It does. It does. I watched all the PM Variety's videos. That's how obsessed I am. And you're like, girl, me too. Look at him. Me too. Freen do that to Becky too. Yeah. The dress with you. All right. 
I'm in Paris right now. Sorry, I'm a little late. Are oh, you good, sweetheart? Shout out to Paris. She said, cover my titty. No, 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 no. Watch this. Watch, let me show you what happened. So what really happened was, if you pay attention, this is how much I've watched this video. So, you know, whatever. If you pay attention, Charlotte was, because they can see each other. They are looking at a, ver they're, they're on live and they can see themselves on live. Charlotte is actually looking at um Fa through the live like she's looking at her through the live trying to play it off instead of just like sitting there staring at her because she she's been caught doing that so much that she kind of tries to play it off now she's been caught where she just be sitting there staring at Fa like you know she's lost in the tulip somewhere you know they skipping off in the sunset together and shit she was looking at her Fa was talking and Charlotte wasn't really paying attention anymore because she was too busy she was like captivated she was staring at her Fa sits the um she's doing the you know the inhaler joint because she got a headache she sits it down and the noise catches um and then she looks at charlotte and the noise catches charlotte's attention and charlotte thinks that Fa, that Fa caught her staring at her through the camera so she looks at her and she goes what Fa sits back and is, all, all Fa is doing is adjusting her jacket she wasn't like trying to get uh charlotte's attention she was literally just adjusting her jacket but watch how uh, Charlotte responds and then watch how they both respond after Charlotte realizes like oh shit I did it again and we on live watch hold on oh god I hate when the noise plays and it's in slow motion that's whack all right watch this so right here Charlotte is looking through the screen at she's literally looking at Fa right now she puts that noise that thing down it makes a noise and Fa was like I mean Charlotte was like what and then she just was like <laughs> It's this, it's the, it's this, right, it's. <laughs> Bro, that shit had me weak. I was like, yo, she was like, got, look, yes, lost in the straight tulips, Tina. Straight lost in the tulips. Foss also said, I love you and was waiting for Charlotte to realize what she said. She said, let me see some. <laughs> she gave her a quick peek. She did, and she realized too. But if you watch it in real slow motion, like I really did, um, you can see that when Charlotte looked down at <laughs> when Charlotte looked down at Fa's chest, she did a little eyebrow raise, like, mm, like, like, <laughs> like she was lost in the sauce. And then Fa was like, she covers herself and leans forward and is like, you know, we did it again, right? And basically, Charlotte was like, just looks at the screen and she's like, Fuck. and then they, and then she blushes and they both just fall out laughing. Look, she was like, you, she, Far was like, you just did it again. Charlotte was like, shit. And then she was like, you know what? Oh, well. <laughs> look, she started blushing like, damn. She was like, I can't, look, look how red her cheeks turn. She was like, I can't believe I just did this shit again. She was like, they gonna have a field day because their fans are like mad. If you ever were, a, um, if you were ever, a, um, y'all, what was what was Camila and Lauren's uh, a fan? What was it called? Damn, Cameron. If you were ever a Cameron uh, fan, their fans are worse than Cameron. And I and I'm so serious. Their fans are way worse than Cameron fans. Every little thing they do, they take it, pick it apart, and analyze the f out of it, bro. They literally, yes, thank you. They literally pick it apart and analyze the F out of it. Y'all say Ing Fa baited her? You think Ing Fa, all right, let's go back. Y'all really think Ing Fa baited her? I don't, if you're watching in real time, I don't think she did. In slow motion, it looks like she did. <laughs> in slow motion, it 100% looks like she was like, yeah, look at these titties. But I swear she did. In real time, she didn't. So they act like Neezy Gang. I think there were, no, bro. I Yeah, yo, yes, but Neezy Gang to like, Neezy Gang on crack. Cause I'm saying like they be like following them around, like actually following them around. Oh, I'm a fan too. Don't get it twisted. I'm in the Inglot. I'm bruh. I'm I'm one of them. Cause it's still some Cameron fans still obsessed as hell today. Now and now I will say the Cameron thing got out of hand because I was a Cameron fan and then when I realized for real for real I was like they not together I backed off of it but there's some people that to this day they still think that they send the messages to each other child they they just as bad as QAnoners if you ask me. Nah, she slick with hers. She wasn't, bro. I swear she wasn't. 
I swear, I swear in five. Okay, I'm gonna show, I'm gonna let it go play in slow motion one more time, but then I'm gonna show you in real time. In real time, Infa didn't even realize what was going on. Char I'm trying to tell you, look at Charlotte's eyes. You can tell she's low key looking at already looking at Infa's chest. That's why when Infa sat back, her eyes were automatically drawn there because that's what the fuck she was looking at when she was looking through the camera. I'm trying to tell y'all. And then Infa was like, Infa was already gonna cover herself because if you don't know, if you watch their shows, that's something that they do. They try to make sure, even though they wear very revealing clothes, they still like cover themselves with like pillows or they wear blankets and also they do that. So when she sat back, she was literally just covering herself. It wasn't like, ooh, look at my tatas. I'm, now I'm gonna cover myself. It was literally just a motion. But Charlotte was already in that zone, bro. I'm trying to tell you. Yeah, it's getting like that with Free and Becky. But Whitney, to be honest, Free and Becky are actually together. Ain't nobody. So you can analyze everything about them. They actually together. And these two, I think, are now. I'm not going to call them. I don't, I'm not going to say that they're girlfriends yet. But they're definitely talking and they definitely done did some stuff. They are bad, bro. Their, their fans are bad to the point where they got to ask their fans to ship with caution. They be like, please, y'all, we it's okay. I, it's cool if y'all ship us, but y'all got to be chill with, they are, their fans are not chill at all. It's almost annoying. There's been videos and anybody who's watched any of the videos, there's been times when I watch their videos and I've been like, bro, I have, I've had to mute it because their fans are so annoying. It's like, I know, but you got in the chats and it's crazy. <laughs> By the way, this Sha Sha, I'm watching on both accounts, running those views up. I appreciate you. Thank you, Sha Sha. I love you. Watching on two accounts. That's my girl, man. All right, now watch this. In slow motion, it really looks like Fa baiting her, but she's not. Fa just sat back and started covering herself. Cause look at Fa's face when she, look at Fa's face when she realized that Charlotte looked down at her. She was like, "What are you doing? Look at her." She was just sitting back to cover herself. It was. That was not bait, bro. Charlotte was already big plot. And thank you, Lex. Thank you, Lex. That's why, that's why in real, I'm gonna put it back in real time. That's why um uh if you if you've seen the uh captions, basically what Ingfa says, and if you understand a little bit of Thai, Ingfa basically said again, like question, like again, question mark, talking about like her, you know, them being caught. And then she looks at the camera and then uh, Charlotte, Fa looks at the camera. And then when Charlotte starts laughing and blushing and turning away, Fa says to her, we just can't get away from it. Basically like, we just can't escape it. Like we just keep having these moments. The interview was for Free and Becky be wilding with their questions, bro. <laughs> no, they do, they, but that's just Thai. Those are Thai interviewers in general because they do the same thing with these two. They be asking them straight up, like, so when's the last time y'all slept together? If the way that we think that our newscasters or our reporters and um and interviewers in America, we think, oh my god, that's so revealing. Why would you ask them that? Our people ain't got nothing on their people. I promise you. Americans ain't got she was not teasing her, bro. I swear to God, she wasn't. SR, she wasn't teasing, baby. I'm telling you, she wasn't. I'm gonna put it back. Like, like I said, it's back in um, I think it's back in real time now. It's back in real time. See, the noise is what got uh, Charlotte's attention. Now, in real time, she was not baiting her. She she just sat back so she could fix her jacket. And Charlotte happened to look down. And then uh, Ingfa was like, again. And then, watch, and then watch. Charlotte looked at her like, damn. And then she started laughing. And right here, Ingfa says... <laughs> she said Kimmy Noto and Kimmy Noto was like a like a like love song thing that they say basically and she basically was like she was like uh you know we just can't escape it that's when Charlotte holds up the paper and behind the paper because you can hear her because they mic'd up I don't know why they be doing this shit like we can't hear them she holds up the paper and she goes Shireen and she basically is telling Fa to play it off as if they're acting like they're characters from the show they're supposed to be in I d Hand to God. Who, 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 who understands that? Who understands that? Fa looked down. Fa looked down because she was trying. Because Fa looked down because Charlotte looked down. I'm trying to tell you. Yeah, you see. Okay, now you see what I'm saying. Fa really was just covering herself. Thank you, Khalifa. Fa was legitimately just covering herself. She she sat back and she was covering herself, but 
all that titty out, I would have looked too. I ain't nobody blaming Charlotte. Look, I mean, ain't nobody blaming Charlotte. I promise you I'm not blaming Charlotte at all because I get it, baby. I get it. I get it. Look at this. Stop. And then she goes, is this Charlene? Shall we play? Uh, sh shall we play the role of the series? We're going to be mean at Charlene on this live. So basically, she's covering for Charlotte being like, okay, I'm going to pretend like this is just us being in character. We'll act like we're in character for the whole live. So that way, when you look at me inappropriately and say more inappropriate shit and do more inappropriate shit, which she did, Charlotte did in the live, she, they could just play it off as their characters. They show is going to be piping hot. And look, let me tell you something. Their boss, the dude that's producing it, he went back and he said that he had them add a love scene. I think he did that because he knows now that they actually together. Their series is supposed to be coming out um, like they somebody, I forgot somebody answered it already. It's supposed to be like between February and at the end of February and March. Just so they have an excuse for it. Eggs Blackly. Eggs Blackly. Thank you. I think it's more than likely they were talking about a dowry. Oh, what's that? I missed something. But anyway, yeah, I'm trying to tell y'all. That's th these two right here, bruh. These two right here, bruh. All right, now, you said go find the gold dresses. I got you. Let me just go back to um PM because PM got all the joints. By the way, if you want to get caught up, I'll, this is my recommendation. If you want to know more about them so you can be as obsessed with them as I am, because they, first of all, they both fine. So if you like women loving women shit, you'll love just watching them anyway. Um, and I love it because it's real. It's like, this is the first time where their situation inspired the show that they're going to be in, as opposed to, you know, how most in most situations where two actors or two people get together, it's like they get put in a situation and then... The characters that they play, they realize, oh, damn, we got real chemistry. And then they start experimenting outside of their roles. And next thing you know, they in a real life couple. They're a real life couple. Like what Brad and Angelina did. R.I.P. Jennifer Aniston. But you know what I'm saying? I'm still Jen. I'm still team Jen. But um, like seriously, that's what their situation is. Where their situation, their situ I mean, their situation is the opposite of that. Their situation was they have real life chemistry. They wrote a script for them to play this shit out. And I honestly think after the show comes out, this is just my opinion. I think after the show comes out and after the last episode, I think that's when they're going to come out publicly as a couple. What y'all think? Oh, Jake, Jake Quellen. I'm already learning Thai. When I tell you, I got the, um, first of all, my, like I said, my sister is Thai. My nephew is half Thai. We finna go to Thailand within the next year because she wants to go back home and I want to visit because I'm obsessed with the women. Um, on top of the fact that I downloaded the Thai keyboard, so when I when I hear songs and when I see titles and things like that, I can type that shit in, so I can learn Thai. I ain't playing with these people. Yeah, I'm still Team Jen. You damn right, not Team Angie. Look at you know what, be Team Jen or or Team Angie, as long as you're not Team uh, Brad. At this point, I don't care. So Ingla, here I come. PM Variety, and there's another uh, uh page I follow. PM Variety does great where they take like the whole lives and they break it down and give you like um subtitles um love lady is another one this one right here this one she basically or this person behind this one they basically just take all the goodies out of like all of the scenes and they give you just the the um the nuggets you know what i'm saying so sometimes if you want to watch the whole thing in context you can watch love ladies uh, page those are the two pages i follow and then um all right but let me go back let me go let me see let me see let me see all right, I'm gonna find the gold dress joint because the gold dress joint was crazy. It was more, yeah, the gold dress joint was 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 crazy for a number of reasons. But hold on, I got you, I got you, I got you. Gold dress joint, gold dress joint. Uh... They be singing love songs to each other and shit. I'm so tired of them. <laughs> And they be like, we just friends. Why are y'all shipping so hard? And even and on the Madam Finn live, which I'm gonna bring that up on the Madam Finn live when Heidi. The one that plays Nita, Heidi called them out on it. And Heidi is their captain, by the way. Heidi is the captain of the Inglot um, ship, in case you didn't know that. Highway Turtle. I've seen every single Highway Turtle video, too. Highway Turtle, if you want to get the story from, um, uh, from the very beginning, Highway Turtle 62, high, I mean, Highway Turtle 2. 
Highway Turtle 2 from the very beginning, that one kind of walks you through everything and it breaks it down based on the, uh, it's basically, it's chronological. Yeah, Freen and Becky be singing, the they be crying and shit, singing love songs, holding each other's hands, twirling and shit. I be like, man, stop playing with us. <laughs> and P-Nom is the cap, thank you, and P-Nom is the captain of the Freen Becky ship. Yup. Heidi be, inst bro, Heidi be instigating like a mug. I'm gonna show y'all that live. Heidi be instigating like a mug. Heidi is hilarious. Oh, and Heidi is hilarious in real life. You know how Nita's all like reserved and like cold and calculating and cool and shit? That's not Heidi. The real Heidi is a goofball. She's a straight goofball. Anybody that knows them knows that's true. Heidi's a straight goofball, bro. Oh, my neck. Mm. Woo, y'all heard that crack? Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? Oh, oh, bah, 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 bah. He go to gold dresses right here. He go to gold dresses. Oh, it's right at the sea. I'm a creep. I'm being. I, I I would say I was exposed if I wasn't being exposed to other creeps. So I don't feel like I'm being exposed. But look at this, bro. Look at this. I'm gonna let y'all. Should I'm not even gonna show y'all this first. I'm gonna show y'all this. Hold on. I'm gonna let y'all see this joint right here. So they were at a like a concert event, right? And one of and the performer was asking him. There's a she has a song, and in her song, there's a moan like a sexual, like a real loud sexual moan, right? So, yeah, the cooking live is funny. I'm, that's I'm sr. I'm bringing that one up. I promise you. Um, did you see the photo shoot with Free and Becky dancing and their shadow? Hmm. Mm. -mm. What you doing, my baby? Oop, I know which part you pulling up. You already know what part I'm pulling up, Khalifa. Like, so watch this. So they were about to moan. They, so they were all, she was asking them all to moan. So she goes and asks if Charlotte can moan. Uh, Fa says no. And she said, daddy said no. Literally, they say, daddy says no. And then, they, and so they basically pin uh, Fa and they go ahead and Charlotte moans. But Charlotte's moan is, what's up? But it's, it's, it's Fa's moan that had me like, bruh. Watch, just watch. That's Heidi in between them. Well, her fine ass. That's Heidi in between them. Oh man, they showed that part. I didn't want y'all to hear her for her joint first, but that's <laughs> okay. Let me do this again. Um, who wants to hear Ing Moan? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I didn't go back far enough. That was my bad. Ing Moans. I will have a job for three months. Oh yeah, they hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, here it is. This is so. This is um Charlotte moaning. Oh yeah, I saw that part, but I didn't know the context behind it. Yeah, I got you. That yeah, you should react to Heidi and Tina. Oh, I got. I did. I did a little. I did a little bit. I did a little bit. But the thing about Heidi and Tina is, as much as as much as they have crazy sexual chemistry, they're nothing. They are literally just friends. I swear they are. Oh, you ain't seen this, Sr. Watch this. I love hearing the moans. Look, watch this. So they asked Charlotte the moan first. And this was the reaction, hold on. So she says, uh -huh. that was Charlotte. Uh -huh. That was Charlotte. Who said America ghetto? America is ghetto. America is a third world country with a Gucci belt. I said it before, I'll say it again. Nikki Dom is coming through. I got y'all. I got y'all, bro. Them moaning on stage, yeah, sign me to F up. I'm trying to tell you, they are effing, for, bro. Thai women, the Thai culture, bro, they are, look, they are not ashamed to be very uh, sexually fluid. I love that one. And they are not ashamed to be just sexually um, open. They, bro, they are, they don't play, they they don't care. They'll, bro, look. Mm. And so now they like, we got to get... Tina just like, <laughs> look, look, and she kept going. That's what's crazy. Charlotte started and kept going. I feel like Charlotte had something to drink before this one, yo. I feel like Charlotte had something to drink. Okay, get ready for your meeting, sweetheart. Bye, yeah, yo. Can y'all imagine all of us in that crowd? Look. Look, we would have been crazy. We moving to Thailand, I'm telling you. I told my girlfriend we going to Thailand just for the sightseeing. Look. 
I went to ask. She said, now they all know. Ingfa, when she's doing her job, don't get it twisted. Ingfa knows how to party. And when I show that Madam Finn live where she gets lit, she gets liquored up to the point where she's staggering. She got blackout drunk on live. And they let that shit stay on TV. They don't care about censorship over there. She got blackout drunk. You see her in the back just taking wine to the head. She got blackout drunk, okay? And she pre-gamed. Before they got in there, she was drinking like spritzers or something. And then she went in there and drank wine. And I mean, she was chugging wine. She wasn't sipping it. She was chugging it. And she got blackout drunk. But any, and Heidi was instigating that shit. They was all drunk, but Ingfa got drunk, drunk. But the reason why she said if five moans for, she said if five moans, I'll have a job for another three months. The lady in the, in the, um, in the jumpsuit, the cat suit, she's the actual singer. She says if I, if five moans, I will have a job for another three months. That's how in love with Fa everybody in Thailand is. Literally. So watch what happens when five moans. Watch how Charlotte reacts when five moans. Everybody say body yayo. Yeah, yayo yeah, yo said if y'all want to link, uh, to, are you talking about to your um to your live, sweetheart? If y'all want to link to her live, she said let her know. Follow her on um Instagram. Her name on Instagram is the same as her name here, right, yayo? Yeah, I did, Kalani, I did watch the uncut love scene for episode 11, and it will be in the reaction. Um, once I cut and edit that, it'll be in the reaction, so you guys will see that tomorrow. Yup. All right, so now, now we about to get into it. All right, so here we go. So everybody's cheering. Who wants to hear Ing Fa Moan? Who wants to hear Ing Fa Moan? And Fa is like, she's, she's in work mode right now, so she's trying to keep it like, conservative but when she does moan i don't know if she was doing it because charlotte was on stage but when she does moan she moans it's the facial expression of breathing in the collapsed chest for me <laughs> Yes, you understand me. Not the music giving black church vibes in the past. I know, I know, I feel you. But did y'all feel that? Did y'all see that? Did you hear that? Exactly, Olivia. Exactly. You said that made your neck do a thing. <laughs> she ain't even have to do it, Lisa. That's all I'm saying. All she had to do was do what everybody else did. Everybody else was like, uh. She said, uh. What, what you breathing and collapsing? You, what is you doing? What are you doing? I, bro, I was done with her when she did that. Look at this. Okay. Running back. But watch Charlotte, though. Okay. They're going to show Charlotte. Watch Charlotte's reaction when they show it. Watch Charlotte's reaction. Look at Charlotte. Watch Charlotte. That's just your sister, Charlotte. What's up? That's her big sister. That's how they say. It. That's her big sister. Charlotte and Heidi. Heidi was sure. Look at Heidi. Heidi was already like this. Heidi was like. <laughs> Heidi was anticipating. Heidi just knew. Heidi just knew that Fa was going to have a sexy ass moan. She just knew. She said it was slight but prominent. Exactly, Sha. That's what I'm saying. That made. You said. <laughs> Whitney said that made my back arch. I'm done. <laughs> you said it made your back arch. Sister giving each other the tingles. All the tingles, you understand me? All of them. She could tell it was real, yeah. She said, and the way Charlotte, Charlotte immediately, first of all, look at how Charlotte is leaning with the arms tucked like, oh, I can't wait. Like in mad, like anxious anticipation, bro. She's in anxious anticipation. You feel me? Charlotte had a flashback. <laughs> no, I don't think she had a flashback. She had a flash forward. They hadn't really done, I don't think they had really done anything yet with uh, here. I think they were still heavy, uh, heavy like flirting, but I don't think they actually had done anything just yet. I think I think their relationship really changed in um, December. Like I think it changed around Charlotte's birthday. Her birthday was like December twelfth or something like that. I think that's when it changed. She said, "Yeah, she definitely. I think I think that was more like a oh." Is that what it's like? I think that, I, and I think, I think after that moan, she said, I gotta fuck around and find out. <laughs> she wanted to know. 
Because I would fax trying to send a message. With that. That's what I said, too. I said the way Fimon, she knew that Charlotte was watching. Look at how Charlotte leaning all hard. Her and Heidi. Heidi talking about some, mm, girl. Look at this. <laughs> look at the look, look at the singer. The singer, her name is Ja. Look at the singer. She looked at Fa like, girl, what the did you just do to all of us? Look, look at her face. <laughs> She's looking like. <laughs> She was looking like, oh my God. It said, listen, I am enjoying my kink of the moans right now. Look, you see, you, have you noticed how many times I played it? Shh, don't say nothing. <laughs> that, yeah, she has some late night material like this, bro. And then Fog gonna, and then Fog gonna give the mic back like, oh, I'm just playing, I'm just playing. Bitch, playing? What you sound like when you're not playing? Fog's energy is crazy. You said perfect pause. Yeah, buddy. Y'all think she's still working? She's definitely still working. Yayo just uh, Yayo just put her link in the um, comments, y'all, for the next live. So make sure that you guys go and um, if you guys want to see what she's got going on, make sure you guys click that link, okay? I'm always here to promote and make sure that you guys get the um, recognition you guys got. Yayo be dropping some knowledge. Go go check it out, man. I'm trying to tell you. All right. <laughs> All right, now, now, hold up, hold up, almost. Now we're going to get to the part. Now we're going to get to the part where they was dancing. Now, I'm going to tell you, Charlotte came out the bag on this one right here. She caught Fa off guard because normally Fa is the aggressive one. Normally Fa is the aggressive one. But Charlotte came out the bag on this one. She had, she made Fa. She said, School of Kink is on February 18th. Okay, School of Kink is on February 18th, everybody. It's uh, it's called School of Kink. It's on February eighteenth. She give them, give them a quick rundown. Yeah, yo, can you put a little just a brief synopsis real quick in the um comments so they know exactly what you got you guys gonna be talking about? Yeah, baby, School of Kink. Yeah, y'all know what she's talking about. I done checked some of her lives out on Instagram. Terry, you back, baby. I know I'm gonna get my Twitch going because I love I love being on live with y'all. I really do, and I want to do it more often. You wasn't lying. You definitely took us down the rabbit hole. I told y'all, and I told y'all I was spending the day with y'all. Did I not keep my word? Am I keeping my word? Am I keeping my word? Am I keeping my word? Facts. Fix. For thank you, y'all. I'm, I'm man. I'm enjoying this with y'all too. I swear I am. I'm enjoying this with y'all. All right, so now I'm gonna show y'all. Like I said, this is she, bro. She had, uh, sh she had five stuck. Charlotte be losing herself sometimes, and she, she didn't give it. I feel like she was mother. She might have had a little drink in her because Charlotte is normally way more. Uh, what's the word? Um, she's normally way more like wound up. Like she's too tight. You know, she's not this lax. But look at how she's doing. She said, you making up for all the days. I am. that, And that was my goal, for real, for real. My goal was to make up for being gone for 10 days. I left y'all for 10 days, so I said, I'm going to give y'all some hours today, man. I'm going to give y'all some hours today. I'm going to give y'all some freedom, Becky. I'm going to give y'all some freedom, Becky. I promise. Hold on. Solicitation Nation needed this. Yes. Bye, Van. I appreciate you, sweetheart. This is just a bunch of creeps in one place. Exactly, Heather. Exactly, sweetie. Exactly, baby. Almost 1 a.m. where I am, but I'm staying. SR, you the GOAT. I love you. Mwah! Everybody tell SR she the GOAT. Give her some encouragement to stay awake. I love you, baby. Yeah. Yeah, yo, you know I'm tapping in. Make sure you send me the link um, because I'm on live, sweetie. Can you make sure you send me the link uh, on Instagram? Chris, what's up? You have definitely found your people. You have definitely found your people. We are here. We are in Glotten and um, friend becky in it up tonight. I promise you. We need a live q and I got y'all. Maybe we can do a Q&A tomorrow. Maybe we can do a Q&A tomorrow. Because I told you I'm going live tomorrow too. So we, we can do a Q&A tomorrow. Yes. SR, you the GOAT. Come on, yeah. Give SR a little bit of... um. Yeah, give SR a little bit of encouragement. She said it's 1 a.m. there. She's still staying with us. I love that. You you the GOAT, baby. Appreciate you. Creep Crew. What's up, Ray Ray? You already know. What's up, Jania? You just got off work. What's up, sweetie? 
It's in my IG and I can also send it to the group chat. Okay, thank you, baby. Do that. Do both. Yeah. This is a fire live reaction. Let's go. Jim, what's up, baby? It's almost 12 a.m. Esther, you got work tomorrow. Nah, Esther, you got work tomorrow now. I love you for hanging, baby, but I don't want you to not be able to get up. I don't want you to not be able to. Everybody give Esther shirt, Nikki. Creep crew. Y'all want a creep crew? So we got rabbit hole merch coming. Y'all want a um, creep crew? Y'all know I can do the creep, na creep nation or creep crew. What y'all want? React to Easy X Natalie game night. I got you, sweetheart. I got you. Esther, good night. Go make those coins, Esther. Right, right. Good night, Esther. I don't want you to. It's 12 a.m. Ghana. Shout out to Ghana. And I'm still here. You got work tomorrow. Give all right. Give give Esther some um. Give Esther some love. UK. Woo. SR, you in the UK, baby. We're specifically in the UK. Nikki, I would love to say I know you don't love us. Be honest. I can't say that. LOL. But you def got to hang with us more on Twitch. Huh? I would love to say I know you don't love us. I do love y'all. What's your name? I like I legitimately love y'all. I like I, I missed the hell out of y'all while I was gone. All right, y'all want Creep Nation and Creep Crew? I got you. Bet done. South Africa is one a.m. All right, let's go back. Let's all right. Let's get back into this now. Let's get back into this now. This is Charlotte. Look at look at this girl. Hold on. Let me go back. Look at look look at this. Look at him. At first, at first, Fa was with it, but look at Charlotte when she really started getting into it. She was like, nah. Look, Fa was like, uh, hold on, watch her switch hands and. Fa had to turn her head and be like, yo, you gotta chill. Fa had, to, she turned her head and told her, you gotta chill. She switched her, she had the mic in this hand. She switched hands, she put the mic in the other hand so she could grip the thigh, y'all. Like, what's up? Like, what's up? You said, and y'all still staying up. Man, I love y'all. I really love y'all. Thank y'all, man. Y'all rocking. It's 108 in South in, um, South Africa, and y'all still rocking with me? Y'all the ones, man. Yo, nah, she knew what she was doing. She did. And Charlotte used to play like that all the time. Because Fa, Fa, to me, Fa fell first, Charlotte fell harder. Because now that, now that we see that Charlotte is falling for her, if you go back and watch, like, go get caught up, y'all. So next time we bring these up, y'all can really be in the vibe with me. When Now that Charlotte has actually fallen for Fa, she's falling way harder than Fa fell for her, bro. You touch my mic, you, girl, you touch my thigh like that, I'm dropping that mic on stage. Oh, God. I'm dropping you and that mic on stage. We about to look. She switched hands, y'all. Charlotte switched. She had the mic in the hand. She said, oh, I'm finna grab that thigh. She said, I'm finna grab it. Look at this. Look at this hell. She said, I, I want that thigh. Bow. That's when Fa was like, okay. Fa was like, you gotta chill. She said, you gotta chill. She said, you gotta chill, bro. I was done. And then just going to dance like she ain't do, bro. It, I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. Okay, so real quick. I want to know. Before I move on, which one y'all, what do y'all want to see next? Do y'all want to see Easy X Natalie? Because I want to be fair. Y'all want to see Easy X Natalie, the game night joint? Or do y'all want to see uh, the Madam Finn live where Fa got dumb drunk and they were saying shit like, if you want something to melt in your mouth, you got to eat me. Which I want? EXN? Easy X Natalie? Give me some answers. Madam Finn live. Okay, let me see. Rewatch it on my way to work tomorrow. Hey! I haven't seen either before. Okay. Y'all want the, oh, y'all want the Madam Finn? Oh, Madam Finn. Oh. Madam Finn looks like it's when I gotta be fair to who's who, the, the majority of people in here. Everybody want Madam Finn. Let's go to the live. Let's go to the live. If you stick around, I will do e Easy X Natalie after that. How about that? If you stick around, I will do Easy X Natalie after that. But we gotta go watch the live, yo. Y'all, the, 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 the majority has spoken and this is a democracy. We actually respect the votes around here. <laughs> we actually respect the votes around here. So let me go ahead and pull that joint up real quick so we can get into it. My goodness gracious, great balls of fire. My goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got you, I got you, I got you. That Madam Finn live was all, it was everything too. 
How far back is it? That joint, oh, it wasn't that far back. I think I went back too far. That was like six months ago. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Where is it at? Where, 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 where is it at? Oh, no, actually, I think it was back that far because that was actually pretty early on in their situation, wasn't it, y'all? Oh! Oh, 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 oh. All right, I'm not going to show the whole thing. Bro, they, you see, she's tripping. She, they, so in that juice bottle, that's that's why, too, bro. They was they were all getting lit. You understand me? You understand me? All right, I'm gonna start it from about right. Let me see where should I start it. I'm gonna start it. Yeah, they was already being freaky. Now Heidi and Fa flirt all the time too. He Heidi flirts with everybody. Yes, this Thai rabbit hole is crazy. I told y'all. Thai TV will have you in a stronghold, bro. Got straight chokeholds out here. Straight chokeholds out here. Straight lit, bruh. All right. Let's get into it. And hold on. No, no, no. I'm not going to watch this version because this version doesn't have good uh, subs. I know exactly where to go for the good subs. I know exactly where to go for the good subs. Hold on. That's how you know I've been watching this shit too much. I know I know which channels to back, bounce back and forth between. <laughs> I know which YouTube channels to bounce back and forth between. Is it going to be this one? It might be this one or it might be Highway Turtle, actually. Let me see. I'm going to... Come on. Where you at? Where you at? To the left, to the left. Everything you own in a box to the left. In my closet, yes, that's my stuff. If I bought it, please don't touch. You keep talking that mess, that's fine. Can you walk and talk at the same time? Bro, <laughs> Neo was talking because that Neo wrote that. Neo was talking his issue on that joint. He writes really well for women. Oh, where is it, y'all? All right, hold on, hold on. I think I think I'm gonna have to go to Highway Turtle. Highway, Highway to Hell. Highway Turtle. Oh, Highway Turtle. Highway Turtle. All right. They stopped making videos, though. They stopped making videos four months ago. This channel, that's why I didn't subscribe to them, because I just watched all the videos. But they stopped making videos four months ago. And the reason why, here we go. And the reason why they stopped making videos uh, four years ago was because... Um, <laughs> she couldn't even eat, bro. She got so fucking drunk. She couldn't even eat, bro. It was... It was... Bro, it was that... Man, I was like, God dang, yeah. But, um... Look at them, they so fine together. Anyway, um, Highway Turtle, because there was some drama uh, that happened. You said Nikki style. Look, there was some drama that happened. You shady, now he writes well for women. I'm just saying. <laughs> Same. Uh, let me see. Well, I was looking forward to seeing the new episode of Gap. I, I was too, but it comes out next weekend, y'all. And I'm, I'm gonna do a live reaction to that. Nikki, you've been watching any stupid wife lives? I haven't, bro. Because, you know, they don't put them in, um, last time I checked, they don't put them in English. I'm stuck with the, down this tight rabbit hole. I'm trying to, look, I, bro, send help. You're going to wake up tomorrow with dark circles because as soon as you get off of this joint, go on TikTok. TikTok is more, is even more of a rabbit hole than Instagram. You know why? Because it's just like bites and snippets. And it's just, you, you be on that joint just like. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, oh, my God. That's what happened to me, bro. Dark circles in the whole nine yards. Everyone is a part of the alphabet people. Deep down. Did you see Free and Becky kiss at their wedding event? I did. I did. I was on TikTok. I told you I was on TikTok hard. All right. So, uh, damn, I forgot what I was going to say. What was I going to say, y'all? Y'all got me distracted with these comments. Okay, anyway, let me get this going. water together with him. Ooh. 
Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, that's not gonna work. I need to just stand up on something. So they pre-game, they was they right there that first scene, they was out there pre-gaming, by the way. They were already drinking. I'll be I'll be back for the next live. Bye. Are you leaving SR? I'ma hop off now. The sleep beating my ass. Okay, baby. I understand. I understand. Let us see that kiss together. Which one? The Becky joint? It's on TikTok. I only saw it on TikTok. I don't know how I don't know. I don't know if it's on here. Nah, bruh. See, when I was Cameron, I tried to give Normina a chance. Normina to me was like uh, Heidi and Tina. They flirted, but I didn't feel any kind of real chemistry between them. I felt like they flirted because they were comfortable with each other, but I knew that there was nothing actually between them. And I don't care what nobody say. At some point, at some point, Camila and Lauren, they did something. At some point, I'm not going to say they had like a full-blown relationship, but they definitely had some sexual chemistry. And knowing how sexual Lauren is, freely sexual. She don't she don't hide it. I know something happened. Some clips had me second-guessing myself. Yeah, I, exactly. Some clips had me second-guessing, but at the same thing with Heidi and Tina. But at the end of the day, I just, I, I did deduce, I deduced that they were just probably, I was like, nah, they were just uh, real close. All right, cool. <laughs> Hold on, let me get to the. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna kind of get to the. Uh... Hold on, they not even real. Drunk. They not even like fully drunk yet. This was a clusterfuck, by the way. This one, this whole live was a cluster, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Heidi's the bro. Heidi is the she's the captain. She said, "Smell me." Look, look. Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! Oh Look at y'all see fire in the background. Look at how she's drinking that wine like it's water. She got blackout drunk, y'all. It felt like Charlotte was getting irritated with ink. You mean like you mean the ship? She was. At one point, she really was. And I think that's because she just didn't understand her own feelings yet. It's hard for you to it's hard for you to process being with somebody when you're not even sure that you even understand the feelings that you have for them. That for certain, I agree. I agree 100%. She was very irritated with them. She was very irritated with the whole ship at one point. In the beginning, it was cool. In the middle, it started getting real like, uh, and now she's just like, whatever. Now she, that's why I know that they're actually together because now she just don't even really care anymore. She'd be like, ah, whatever. <laughs> and Ingfa is a major flirt. Oh, you mean in this live? Oh, you think that she was getting irritated with Ingfa? Oh, you said Ingfa? I thought you said Inglot. You think so? I didn't catch that vibe. I don't think that she got irritated because especially when she got real, real drunk towards the end. You got to watch the... Have you seen the actual whole live? Because I've seen the actual whole live. The whole live is on... Um, the whole live is on the other channel, the uh, the PM Variety. If you go watch... It's just the, it, the subtitles are not good on that. That's why I didn't show that one. But... um. On that one, on that one, nah. She was giving as much. As, she was giving. She wasn't getting irritated. You what? What did you see the whole live? Oh, towards the end. Well, yeah, because because she was blackout drunk. She and it wasn't even that. It wasn't even that she was like majorly irritated. It's that she was like concerned that Fa was gonna reveal too much. Because there was one point where Fa still, Fa was so drunk. She's Mike. You see how they got those black things on her on her collars? Those are mics. Fa said, um, Fa leaned on her. She was drunk. She just kept leaning on everybody. She leaned on her and she said, I got too drunk. And and uh, Charlotte immediately covered her mic and then took the mic off. Because she was like, nah, she probably about to, she, she probably about to say some shit that she don't need to be saying. And this was even before she went to, her, um, this was before she went to do the Miss Grand International. And I think Charlotte was more concerned that this live would affect her being able to participate in the contest. 
Because, you know, there's a certain way you got to carry yourself as a beauty queen. I don't know if y'all know that, but they have like, you know, uh, conservative standards to a very, to a certain degree. Yeah. Yeah. She wasn't getting irritated with um, Fox. She was like more like, uh, you're fucking, you might be like, she didn't want her to fuck up, you know, any future choices, chances. And she, cause she got, but if you saw this whole live, she got belligerently drunk. By the end, she could not stand on her own. They when they when she did uh Infa went live the next day and she literally said, I don't remember anything from the night before. She was like, I had to be carried, not dragged or walked. She had to be physically picked up, hoisted off the ground, and carried to her room. She got blackout drunk. No, I don't want to watch what? No, I don't want to watch episode 12 if it's not on their channel though. I appreciate that, sweetie, but I don't want to watch the episode if it's not on their channel. Because I've seen a lot of people already uploading it, and I think that's disrespectful. When people do that kind of work, I like to respect the original artist. And I want to give the view to the people who uh, did the work. It'd be different if it was like a reaction or something. Look at me trying to clear myself up. It'd be different if it was like a reaction or something, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> But if it's just them co literally copying somebody else's work and just posting it online, nah, I don't like that. Yeah, there's a copycat Idol Factory page. I've seen that joint too. I don't like that. Yeah, okay. So anyway, let me get back to this. I'm about to show y'all. <laughs> So she's right now, Fi not even buzzed yet, but she gonna keep going back and you gonna see. Why? Don't have eat. Man. Bye, Sha Sha, appreciate you. See you, Olivia, appreciate you. All right, see you guys later. Listen, watch this, watch this. And watch Heidi's reaction. She said, Charlotte said, she was basically saying she's boiling carrots and she likes her carrots to be super, super rubbery. She basically said, I like something that's going to melt in my mouth. That's what Charlotte said about the carrots. Ingfa said, then you have to eat me if you want something that's going to melt in your mouth. I'm, look, look, look. Okay, Shaw, if you come back, I'll see you when you come back. Look at Heidi. Heidi said, that's why, that's why um, Charlotte went and smacked her on the ass. Look at Heidi. Look at Heidi. Heidi had my reaction when I first heard it. Heidi said, did you hear what she just said? Charlotte be like, shut up and cook, bitch. Heidi said, uh-uh, she told her to eat her. Heidi said, Heidi said, nah, uh uh. Heidi literally, Heidi's reaction was, girl, look, child, they are something else. I'm trying to tell you. Heidi's reaction was everything, y'all. Look look at Heidi. Heidi looked up like, I'm going to shut up. I'm not going to talk through it. Heidi said, hold on. Bro, Heidi is crazy. Heidi is crazy. Heidi literally said, he's like, all right, I'm back, but I'm still behind. You good? What's up, Kira? What's up, babe? What's up? What's up? I told y'all y'all could tap in and tap out. I told y'all I was going to be here. Heidi's crazy, bro. Heidi said, um, yes, Heidi was like, did y'all, Heidi stopped mid-sentence. She was like, yeah, so what you got to do is, did y'all hear that? And then she said, she told her she got to eat her. Then she proceeded to repeat it, and Charlotte was sitting there like, "Bitch, just cook." Like Charlotte, look at this. Charlotte was like, "Bitch, just focus on what you what you're doing with with, with with the food and stuff you got going on." You can literally hear the shot. Yes, Heidi is literally their P nom. Heidi is the P nom, like how P nom is uh, free and Becky. Heidi is that for them. Heidi said, "I know y'all heard that facts." She was like, "I know I ain't the only person that heard that, bro. I can't be." Ooh, they eating, uh... She said, she said, 
ช่วยพูดด้วยสิ She said I know I ain't the only one เฮ้ยยำก็ต้องยำแค่ไหนก็ต้องยำ And then eat for over there cooking Charlotte's carrots ทุกคนที่คุณรักคุณก็จะต้องทำอะไรแบบนี้แหละค่ะคุณ She said you gotta learn how to make them joints Just in case y'all get hurt Look ที่รักทุกคน Charlotte was trying to process it too, but tried to keep that shit moving. She really did, Lex. She really did. <laughs> Not the salt, babe. <laughs> If I'm over there complaining, tell me something. I don't understand why I'm over here standing. Why I'm the one standing over here boiling these damn carrots, and I'm not even gonna eat them shits, bro. Yeah, she know that exactly. Charlotte ass was trying to pro. It was Charlotte asking, um, you heard that, LMAO. Yeah, you know damn well she heard that, right? <laughs> right. Right. Why? Why? Because Charlotte wants to eat, so she doesn't have to eat. 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 She doesn't I was like, how did she not realize she was doing too much? She just back there, like they brought her like four glasses. She had two out there and she had spritzers. I was like, girl, you had a bottle of wine to yourself. That's okay when you said your internet's going in and out. Yeah, I'm still alive. I ain't look. I'm, I'm chilling, chilling. No, no, no. They said they were in their own world. Look, they was in their own world. Look at them. The, now, mind you, they're actually supposed to be selling a product, which is the perfumes. They're selling the perfumes, and then Ingfa has her own fermented fish sauce, which is what they're all cooking with. They're selling two products. Heidi over there doing her job. She done made a dish, bringing it over to the CEO of the company who uh, sells the perfume, letting her eat the food. Look at these two. And to the point where the CEO pulls Heidi and is like, look, like, you might as well stop talking because can't nobody hear you because everybody focused on them two. Look, not even paying it. Like y'all are here to do a real job. Info was all in her face, bro. So Info is starting. Info is starting to feel tipsy, right? Because Info, look how flirty she's being right now. She said. She said, "Don't lean." She said, "Don't lean in on me like that." Ingfa said, don't lean in on me like that. Do not lean in on me like that. And then Heidi gonna tell me something. What'll happen if I do? Heidi, 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 now this is the thing that always got me, bro. This the thing that gets me. Charlotte be sitting there. She used to sit there and act like she was so irritated, right? She used to act like she was so irritated with the way that everybody was overly shipping them. But look at this shit that she does right here. Olivia, you ain't miss nothing, baby. What's up? Welcome back, baby. You ain't miss nothing. We still tapped in. Look at fire in the back drinking again. Oh yeah, that's right. I missed it. Hold on. Look at fire, y'all. Look, look how she's drinking that shit. She's chugging wine. And it's red wine, and I don't know if y'all know about wine overseas, but their alcohol levels be on a whole different a whole different level, bro. She's back there chugging. Make sure y'all save this live. I missed the live. I, oh, I'm definitely saving it, sweetheart. I'm definitely saving it. She's look look at this. Somebody come and take a look at this in my Kevin Hart voice. Somebody come and take a look at this. She's back there chugging. Look at the wine glass just blow. This shit like a baby's bottle just tilted, bro. But this is what I mean. Watch Charlotte. She acting like it's water. Facts. Girl, that is not water. Now watch this shit that Charlotte does right here. And then she be real irritated when the people be shipping them. Look at this shit. I know you fucking lying. He said, damn, Fox showing she ain't no hoe. <laughs> Charlotte cutting the damn tomato and Fox stuck. I mean, straight stuck. Look at this. Fox was like. 
<laughs> Heidi was like, "Are you tripling?" She was like, "Hey, daddy, what's going on?" I told you, I told you they all call her daddy. She was like, "Daddy, how's it going?" If I played it off though, that's because that's daddy. Cause that's that. I'm trying to tell you, cause that's daddy. If I was biting that lip, bro, she was biting that tongue. She was definitely biting that tongue. Like I, oh my god, like that. She knew exact. Thank you. Charlotte knew what she was doing. She was playing games, bro. Charlotte was playing games. If I was super turned on, what's up, Savoya? If I was super turned on, bro, I ain't playing with her. And Charlotte knew what she was doing. And they're gonna turn around and tell me something. I'm playing, I'm playing. Charlotte, if I was like, I'm good. I'm good. That's still daddy. I'm good. She was like, I'm good, but hold on. Let me let me touch her real quick. She was like, she had to touch her after that. Look how she gripped her hand, bro. <laughs> Charlotte, absolutely. <laughs> oh, this part right here. Charlotte gonna ask, how do you sound when you get a knife cut? Why do you think she asked that? Do y'all know this game? Have y'all ever played this game? What's the sound you make when you get a cut? I know, I know I'm not the only one that did this when I was a kid. It was it was an excuse to moan. Talk to me, y'all. Y'all don't know this game? What sound do you make when you what sound do you make when you get a knife cut? For real? Dang. Well, you're about to be introduced. Okay, well, shit. Oh, I got one. Yes, thank you, Khalifa. Khalifa, where you from? Cause me and you like right here. We 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 here. Where you from? <laughs> you said ouch. <laughs> ouch. That's the sound I make. Uh, well, that's what normally people, most people would be like, ah, or ouch, right? But when we were younger, it would, it, when we were younger, we used to, um, that Peter Griffin joint. Yeah, we used to be like, we used, to, it was an excuse to moan, like, ah, you know, like, cause you know, sometimes you get a cut, you'd be like, ah, like that, but it was a way to do it, but more sexy. So now that you know, yes, Nikki, alcohol in Asia is very potent. Exactly. Alcohol in Asia. Thank you. Thank you. Um, you make a sound, not curse. No, if I, I would, I curse when I stub my toe, I'd be like, shit. But if I cut myself, I'd be like, that's normally when I cut myself. When I cut myself, it's more like a, yup, it's a hit. I hit a smooth hiss. Thanks, Le me and Lex. Black cat cow. All right. Khalifa, you said you from the U.S. Virgin Islands. Okay, baby, because you just, you be knowing. You be knowing. But look at this. I want y'all to watch this game. So Charlotte asked Heidi to do it. But people are saying, no, you do it. That's why I looked at her like, bitch, I know that's not how you sound when you get a knife cut. <laughs> that was an excuse to moan again. Oh, yeah, I was a freak. Yeah, I, I've been a freak and I am a freak and still a freak. Yup, do the same thing. Look, she knew that. She knew exactly. Charlotte brought, the, if Charlotte was the one that brought the game up, why do you think she brought the game up? She asked, she asked Heidi to do it first because she knew that after Heidi was going to do it, she was going to do it. But when she brought it up, Ingfa was like, nah, let me hear you do it. And that's when she going to tell me some, I... Girl, stop. You said, I'm crying at her asking her to do it and then her doing it, right? Because <laughs> she was going to do it. That was the point. Charlotte wanted to do it anyway, bro. You said, there goes your neck doing that thing again. <laughs> you a freak. You cut yourself in, mom. A little bit. I like a little pain. Y'all know how to, y'all, I done already told y'all that. I'm a little bit of a, I'm a, I'm a little bit of a masochist. <laughs> Watch this shit. I was like, bitch, I know that's not how you moan. This she's like, but since she's like, I'm gonna take you out back. <laughs> Why how do you lean over like that? I was born a freak, I won't go down to facts with me. Now she knows damn well she was ready. Uh, uh, and then Fa, you you can tell uh, Fa drunk. She told me when I get. She said when I cut my finger, I'm just like. Uh. <laughs> Heidi is a. I told y'all Heidi is hilarious, bro. And then she tried to play it off and ask Heidi, right? Oh. Yes. Oh. Noodles getting soft. Look, look, she ain't that drunk. She was like, get them noodles. Get them noodles. Bye, Odessa. Everybody say bye to Odessa. Heidi is hilarious, bro. Heidi is, look, Heidi like, look at them, look at them, look at them. Heidi 
It's crazy. It's crazy. Time, but it ain't you said, hold on, what'd you say? Jay Quellen said, what? What kind of childhood games y'all be playing over there? Girl, hide and go get it. We used to play that too. You know how you got hide and seek? We used to play hide and go get it. Who play hide and go get it? I know I ain't on it. Now, come on now. Y'all might not have played the knife cut game, but I know for damn sure y'all play hide and go get it. Y'all know what that was? You ever heard of house? You mean like playing house? Yeah, we used to do that too. But hide and go get it? Hide and go get it was the shit. Soft and wet is the theme in here. The noodles are corn. <laughs> All right, right. Yes, thank you, everybody. Yes, every thank you. Everybody played hide and go get it. Thank you. That's what I'm saying. We used to play that shit all the time. And you talking about some freak? We ain't know what we was doing, but we were being freaky. We used to play house. We used to play doctor. Um, I used to play husband and wife. I was always the husband. <laughs> yeah. What? Well, what's hide and go get it? It's hide and seek. But the person who was it, whoever you find first. <laughs> you get me you whoever you find first y'all do something you know what i'm saying let's play sheet ghost yo i ain't heard that one that's new whitney not sheet ghost not sheet ghost you said how house is how i discovered i like playing with girls house is how i discovered i like playing with no how to go get it is how i discovered i like playing with girls yeah bro yes yeah let's play hide and go get go get once <laughs> I purposely would act like I didn't see who I didn't like. Right, right, right. I would be peeking like shit. I know is that I'm going right behind that tree. We was nasty, bro. We was so nasty. Play doctor, husband, and wife. All right, I want to get to. Hold on, I want to get to this next part though. Hold on, there's this one part right here that I was just like, this part right here. Yo, this part right here. Look at this. She so she's finna feed Charlotte. She got the noodles. You see how she got the noodles and they draping. You know everybody know that when you eat noodles. Well, I don't know how everybody else eats them. I normally uh, when I eat noodles ramen, I break them so that they're shorter because I don't like to twirl my noodles. I like to I like to eat them like that. Um, and so she Charlotte was like, "Can you at least twirl them around the fork for me?" Infa said, "No, use your tongue." And now I want y'all to see what Charlotte does. That's you like I, I'm not playing with her. Oh, she ghost is from Gap. When did they say she ghost? Yo, we wonder how elementary kids be having kids. Look, look, we was off the chain. Anyway, watch this part. Watch this part. Yeah. I ain't playing with her. I ain't playing with her. Look at how she, look at how she, when Fa said, Fa said, no, 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 my, 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 use your tongue. And she said, the way she flicked that tongue out, rolled it, scooped the noodles and, I am, okay. You know, I know my tongue, I know tongue gymnastics, okay? I know tongue gymnastics. And that was tongue gymnastics right there. She said she ain't never been with a girl. Well, she's a natural. <laughs> she's a natural. Oh, when they first learned that Mon slept over at Sam's house. Oh, that's right. She goes. That's right. Look at this shit again, y'all. If I said, once again, I'm going to take your ass out back. And then he look at what Heidi said. Heidi said, y'all tell them to ship with caution, but y'all be, she said, but y'all be so unaware. Like, she basically was like, y'all can't tell them. Yes, at the restaurant. She was like, y'all can't tell them, um, y'all can't tell them to uh, ship with caution and then do some shit like this. Charlotte knew what she was doing, bro. Uh, uh, now watch Heidi. Her oh, silly ass. <laughs> she said, why don't I look as sexy as uh, uh, Charlotte when she do it? All right, I'm about to skip a little bit so y'all can see just how drunk. All right, now. She brought the wine. Look, y'all see how lit I got? She brought, she said, I'm the only one here. Everyone's, she said, I'm the only one here. Everyone's gone drunk. That's what Charlotte said. Heidi and Fa were getting lit. Heidi had three full glasses herself, and then her and uh, Fa kept sharing the wine that was bring, being brought out. Uh, Charlotte don't really like wine, so she wasn't really drinking the wine. But you see, Fa just brought the wine. She said, fuck it, I'm not even... <laughs> 
She said, I'm not even going to go to the back no more. She said, I'm going to bring the wine and just put it right here next to me so I don't got to walk back. Look at this. Oh, this is when she told, um, she, so what's her name? Charlotte was drinking wine out of a jug and she took it and she said, um, and Fa took the wine from Charlotte and was like, I thought you said you don't even like wine. But then she proceeds to like chug another glass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rock some, rock some. Look, 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 look. She was drinking that. That's why she came and took it. She was like, I'm the only one that ain't drunk though. She got Charlotte was mad. Look at, look at them. Look at them. Look at. Now y'all, Fa about to be. Fa's already gone, by the way. But you about to see when she black. When she get black out, that's when she start leaning and. Look at Heidi. Yeah, Fa's eyes were staying closed hella long. Tongue nastics, I'm trying to tell you, yes. If Charlotte had gotten drunk, because when Charlotte got drunk, they did a live where Charlotte got drunk, and Charlotte was telling her, she was telling um Fa, they like they weren't in the same room, they were in separate rooms, but they were like Fa was on live and Charlotte was uh watching her live while she was drunk. She was telling shit like, come to my room and uh come lay down with me and come put me to bed and stuff. And Fa was so good. She was a gentle woman. She was like, nah, I can't do it. She's like, cause I know she's a, she's like, I know she in that room drunk. She said, and I know if I go in there. Fa, I, I said, Fa got, she had easy level restraint. Fa was like, nah, she, think about how many nights easy probably had to do that. She was like, nah, I know she lit and I do not want her, I don't want to put her in that situation. So she was like, I'm just going to stay over here. But yeah, I agree. If Charlotte had a got lit, Nikki, what do you do? What do you think about you having a discord? Child, I don't know how to work it, but if I could figure it out, I would love to do it. Man, if Charlotte was lit, it would be a whole different live. It would have been, oh, y'all yeah, already read that. Yeah, that, yeah. You know which live I'm talking about? Fa sent Nudie to check on her. Yes. Thank you. Yes, Khalifa. She sent Nudie to check on her. She was so lit in that room. And Charlotte was Charlotte was in the comments. She was in the comments on the live just being reckless. She was like, come. She said, come. She was like, come um, come to my room. Come lay with me. Come. And if I was like, bro, if I go in there, we are not going to be sleeping. <laughs> she was like, right. she was like, hell nah. She was like, chance of a couple in the future. And she's, hold on, wait. Did you see friend Becky interview? Friend talked about them being sisters and they asked about any chance of couple in the future. And she said, I don't know. Their whole reaction was, they're definitely a couple. Victoria, baby, the baby, they, they're a couple. It ain't no couple in the future. It ain't no couple soon to come. It ain't no, they just real close. They are a full blown couple right now. You cannot convince me that Freen and Becky are not together. They can't convince me that they're not together because they can't convince each other they're not together because they act like a whole couple. They, yeah. I have so much video to watch after this live. <laughs> so many videos, I'm trying to tell you. Now Heidi's already gone. Heidi's gone. Look at Fa, look at Fa. Look at Fa, Fa, like, I'm a... Fa was looking like, look at Fa. Fa went from clapping to just being like... Look. Look at Fa. Fa said enough. Fa said enough, bro. Fa said enough. We just waiting for them to go public. Exactly. You said the way you agreeing with everything I'm talking about, just to, just as deep in these ships. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm tr I'm trying to tell you, bro. Like, ain't no way. She look. She look at far. Look at far. You said I'm just saying they were asked if they were together and they looked so sus and started laughing because baby because we know they know they don't have look. It's hard to lie because especially when you're a person of integrity, it's hard to lie about something like that. On top of the fact that we got all the clips. Fa gave her that look. Yeah, Fa gave definitely gave her that look. Fa said that's too much. Now look at Fa drunk ass. Look, look, she child, she done went all the way down to the ground with her shit. Again, again, those Meganese kicked in. The Meganese. Even drunk, even drunk, the Meganese. Meganese. Look, down, down, gone. 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 She was all the way there. She's gone. I'm gonna I'm gonna let y'all know when she black out though. You can literally see it that she's no longer there. Look, look, black out. 
This is when she got blackout right here. Look at her. First of all, her and Heidi are stumbling and Charlotte's trying to keep them both up. But um, you said, I feel the same way. They just don't want to go public. Yeah, again, I, I agree. I agree. Okay, I'll see you. I'll see you. I'll see you in a little bit, Whitney. You say you're gonna be right back. Okay. She look. She's gone. She's blacked out. Heidi didn't get black. Heidi's just drunk. But Fa is literally. It said, "Hey, daddy, you won't stop hugging." That's look. Look. She. She's. Oh God, bro! It was so bad. It was. They did this live. Why would they do her like this live? Charlotte's the only one that's still capable of selling. If I'm taking a whole nap on her shoulder, look, 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 look. She, like, I said, I, she said, I can't sell shit. She looked at her like, you gonna say something? She said, I can't sell shit. Y'all sell this. She said, y'all sell it. Y'all sell it. If I'm being a clingy drunk, yes. Super clingy. She's standing next to whoever can hold her. She just like, bro, I just need somebody to hold me up right now. Look, that's why they fanning her. Look, look, look. She, you can tell that. Look, that's, ooh, man, I've been there, bro. I've been there. This is right here. This is when she said, I'm too drunk, and Charlotte said, stop talking. And that's when she took her mic. I'm trying to tell you. Look, 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 look. She was like, she covered the mic, and then she took it eventually. She was like, she covered her mic, because she was so, she just wanted, she didn't want her to ruin any of her future uh, job opportunities. She was like, look, 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 look. She said, take, yup. She said, give me that shit. She said, give me that shit. She said, help me talk, bro. <laughs> Yo. See, this is what I mean. I get, so I get what you're saying when you thought that she was saying that she was irritated with her. She was not irritated with her. She wasn't irritated with her. She was just like, yo, you're so done right now. Like, you you need to go sit down, bro. How you said chocolate? So the live ends with sweet. They trying to hurry up and end this shit. That's a responsible wifey, right? Exactly. She was being a wife. I don't know how Fox still looking at her phone. Because she's sitting there swaying. Look at her trying to feed her something. Look at her trying to make her eat. She's like, babe, you got to do. She's like, you got to eat something. Even if it's just chocolate. Look at her. She's like, if I like, you ever been that drunk, bro? I've been that drunk where if you just put something near my lips, I'd be like, nigga, I don't want nothing. I don't want it. Yeah, this part was the part that took me out. What's up? You finished eating? What you had to eat, baby? What's up, Shasha? Welcome back. What you had to eat? Because Fa didn't want that chocolate and Charlotte knew that. Yeah, she really didn't. She didn't want the chocolate. She wanted Charlotte, but she also needed to take her ass and lay down. She didn't want no food, actually. But she was like, you need to eat something. She was like, uh, look, look. She was like, she was like, she looked like she was about to Earl right there. She was like, I can't. She said, I'll eat it then. Look, look, look. Y'all, somebody need to go sit her down, bro. Yeah, this part right here was the part. And I'm telling you, still trying to feed her. Look, she like, I don't want it. She said, I don't want it. She said, yeah, daddy. Wait, no. Look, look. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Charlotte, see, that's what I'm saying. Stuff like she was doing all that stuff. Charlotte was playing with her the whole time. Oh, God, she was playing with her the whole time. You said Charlotte put her arm against Fa's shoulder to keep her back. Yeah. Yellow rice with beans, meatballs, jerk chicken, and pasta stuff. And you ain't bring, Shasha didn't bring none of that for the rest of us. Y'all know what Shasha had for dinner? She had... She had yellow rice with beans, meatballs, jerk chicken, pasta salad. She went in, and, and she ain't bring none of us nothing. She ain't bring us nothing. Y'all, you see how Char Charlotte faced when Heidi kissed her? No, wait, what? When her, wait, where are you? When? At the end? We talking about what kiss? We talking about? Should I say it? Heidi said, I know, they're a couple. She worse than P9, if you ask me. I don't know, they probably about the same. Yeah, they just doing highlights right there. But she got so drunk, I wonder if they gonna show it. Well, this is her talking about it at the end. But she literally got so drunk that there was one point in the live where she was sitting down in the back, bro. You said go back more. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Shasha. You said don't put your own blast. I'm sorry, babe. 
But you could have brought a little something, something back for the rest of us. That's all I'm saying. You could have brought a little something, just a little something, <laughs> just a little something, something. But um, yeah, that shit right there. Heidi be looking so confused. That's because they are confusing. I would be looking confused too because they be playing too much. Look at them. Look at them. The way Becky be looking at Free, like Free be looking at Becky away, but the way, but the way Becky be looking at Free. The way Becky be looking at Freem. Oh, you know, I don't mean no harm, but I don't really like his videos because he be doing too much, like, with the typing and stuff down at the bottom. And one time, he tried, I think he did, like, a sexy montage with his voice or something. It was weird. Jealous and possessive moments. Oh, this is a good one. Man. Oh, yeah, this is a good one. I watched this one already. Let's watch this one. <laughs> Somebody, you said, so are these Freem Becky people from Gra Gap 2, them and the Inglot girls? So the Inglot girls, Ingfa and Charlotte are not, they have their own series that's coming out. It's called Show Me Love. No, they are actually just beauty pageant queens. Becky and Freen are the only ones that are actually uh, from the Gap. And Heidi, and Heidi. This is the one, I think, the, ain't that the episode we was talking, the um, scene, with the, uh, I mean, isn't this the um, joint they was we was talking about earlier when she took the hands away? Hold on. Oh, no, this is the one when, um, there was one where Freen was giving, was putting, like, lotion or something. Look, 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 look. Look at Becky. Like, what you holding her for? This is when um, Becky's leg, remember when I told y'all Becky's leg was hurt? She had to be carried around. Friend in the back looking tight. Not that you want to sleep with me. Friend was like, wait, what? <laughs> Friend started smiling, but then she was like, she was like, ah, wait, what did you just say? Bro, stop with the music, dog. She, yeah, she ain't like that. Oh my God, the music. She ain't like that. Do you feel jealous when she gets close to others? She pushed that, she pushing Kirk away. She said, no, no. <laughs> Look at Becky literally pushing it. Like, he told he don't touch her. Oh, she can talk to anyone and go anywhere? Mm. Freen looked like she didn't agree with that. Look. Freen was like, she was like, well, you can't. She said she can talk to anybody and go anywhere. Freen was looking like, well, you can't. <laughs> she said that moment hit her like a truck. What moment? Did you see Freen face? Which moment? What y'all talking about? Oh, you talking about when, yeah. When she said, y'all want to um, go to sleep. She was like, you want to sleep with me? Freen was like, ah, wait, what? She was not playing. I love how Freen says she's Freen always does that. So uh if you ever catch Freen being like, I'm confused, because she said the same thing in that live when she popped in. She said, Oh, you people can flirt with you. She said, I'm confused. Whenever she gets jealous, that's what she says. She says, I'm confused. Becky a trip. Look at Becky. Literally, <laughs> she playing basketball defense, bro. Look at right. Look at this. She's smacking his hand away. I don't see your comic here. I'm sorry. Not your mother in law. What? <laughs> not threatening people with a oh 
There was one live. I wonder if they're going to show it in this one. There was one live. You said, I'm going to send a link. Oh, you said scroll up. Okay. Okay. Oh, you said there's an Inglot live where they are selling makeup. And there's a couple of them where they're selling makeup. Which one are you talking about? Are you talking about the one where they're in the, um, like the pajamas, the white silk pajamas in front of that big window? Because she was 100% thirsty in that one. If you're talking about another one, I don't know which one you're talking about, sweetie. But um, Becky doesn't have any chills. She chooses violence when it comes to Freen. She really does. There was, But let me tell you how Freen chooses violence. There was a video, there was a live that they did. And uh, somebody came in and commented in Thai, um, to have an onion also means to get a kiss, right? It means to get a kiss. So somebody asked her trying to be slick and throw, her, throw Becky a line. They were trying to flirt with Becky. And they said... Becky, do you have a kitchen in your house? Cause I want an onion. Basically saying I want a kiss. And free at first, Becky, because you know Becky doesn't like Ty is her second language. So at first she was like an onion and she was like, oh, you mean a kiss? Free said, <laughs> Free said, I have a knife. <laughs> do you want to get cut? No. <laughs> she said, I have a knife. Do you want to get cut? Bro, I was done when she said that. I was like, no, she didn't. You said, yes, that one. Yup, that exact live. Ex bro, that live was crazy, bro. Oh, you talking about, are you responding to Ingfa? Oh, you, okay, that's the one you talking about. Yeah, that one was crazy. Yeah. Oh, wow, I missed that live. Freen, one of them ones. Freen is one of them ones. That's why I try to tell y'all. Freen, to me, is more scary when she's um angry. She is, bro, oh, damn, my phone about to, oh, I need to, hold on, y'all, stand by, let me go get the, um, charger for my phone. Ugh. Let's go ahead and get that connected so that don't die on me, I need that so I can keep looking at your comments while I'm doing this. All right, so, um... Yeah, that that joint right there, that live was crazy. When Freen said that, I was like, no, she didn't. She literally said, do you want a knife? She said, she said, I got a knife. Do you want to get cut? I was like, God dang, bruh. You said Freen wanted one. Yeah, where are the links? Uh, you said Charlotte spent the entire live staring at Fox. She really did. Yeah, and that's what I said earlier, Ams, too. I said the same thing. I said Freen, to me, is more possessive of Becky than Becky is of her. Like, Becky does it, she, but she always makes it seem, like, playful. When Becky, start, when Becky gets jealous, she always makes it seem playful. Freen does not. I'm still trying to come across that the one where Becky said that she don't have a girlfriend while they were in front of a crowd, and Freen looked at her like, you're going to get your ass whooped on this stage. That's the one. Thank you, Whitney. Facts. <laughs> Most of the lives, y'all gotta go on. Um, you know what? After this one, I'm gonna go to TikTok. I'm gonna show y'all. It's really on TikTok. I'm gonna show y'all on TikTok, bro. TikTok. The TikTok moments with Free and Becky are crazy. That's Freen looks so pretty right there. Look at this. <laughs> Why they play that music on Freen like that? <laughs> Don't do that. That's, oh, look, that's the one where she slapped P Nam's hand down. That's the one I wanted to show y'all, too. Look at this. They be doing P9 dirty, bruh. That's the one. Oh, it went by so fast. Hold on. Let me slow that shit down, bro. That's the one where Becky was playing the game. She was playing like a hand game, like patty cake style with one of their um their fans. Freen took the, the fan like, oh my gosh. She took the fan's hands away. Like, girl, what are you doing? Like, ain't <laughs> we don't do that around these parts. Look, right here. Oh, I'm going to slow them both down so you can see. That's her pushing P Nam head away. This was P Nam like trying to hold Becky's hand. She was like, Freen was like, nope, won't be none of that. <laughs> she said, it won't be none of that. And then this was Becky and this person playing. Look, Freen said, yeah, 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 I don't care about it. Becky couldn't do nothing but laugh. Becky was like, oh, damn. P Nam tried to go behind her to get to Becky. Look, look, she rubbing all on her thigh and shit, on her hip. 
Freen don't be playing, bro. Oh, wow. Let me go back to normal speed now. She said, move it right. <laughs> Freen be on Sam level of jealousy. She really do. Freen to me is way more aggressive in her jealousy. Like, she be getting actually angry. You said Freen asked somebody... You said Freen asked, also asked a fan if they like being a bee instead of a human when they said they wanted to be Becky's honey. Honey equals fans that want to date Becky. She's... <laughs> Bruh. Bruh, she's a mess. She's a mess. Free be manhandling folks for Brecky. She really do. See, when Becky when Becky gets jealous, she always makes it playful. Free don't. Free really don't. Free be looking you dead in your face like that's my woman. Hold on, let me get the I'm gonna get TikTok popping. Cause for me, yeah, there we go, TikTok. Tic Tac. Let me bring Tic Tac up. Jealous friend. I'm going to see if I can just do jealous friend because I really want y'all to hold on. I really want to find that one scene. Friend. <gasps> I found it. Here it is. Oh my God. Finally, bro. Okay. So in this joint right here, obviously, like I said, somebody said, so Becky, don't. So Becky don't have a girlfriend, right? They're asking like, so you don't have a girlfriend, right? And Becky was like, nah. She was like, nah, nah. Look how she looked at, but look at how she looked over at, hold on. Look how she looked over because she knew Freem was going to say something. Look at Freem. Arms folded and everything like, bitch, you better fix that. Look. She said, so free, so Becky fixed it. This is how Becky tried to fix it. She said, I only have mommy honey, which is, uh, you know. And then she says, I got mommy honey and then watch. And she said, oh, and T-Doc. T-Doc was free because she called her darling. That, bro, I was like, when you look at Freen's face, the way when Becky said, no, nah, I ain't got no girl. She was like, uh, no, nah, I ain't got no girl. And then she immediately looked at Freen. Freen looked at her and folded her in front of everybody. Like, we, that's, op, that's mad energy right there. Mad jealous energy. She folded her arms like, I know you better. And then looked at the back at the fan who asked and then looked at Becky like, I know you better tell her the truth. You better fix this. Sh bro, I was like, yeah, man. Right, I know, Ren, like, it only took three hours. I know, bro. I've been looking for this scene, this one clip, bro. But look look at her face, bro. Freen was not playing. We sh Hold on, I got to run that back one more time, one more again. Look at this shit, him. She said, no, I don't have... She tried to fix that shit. Freen was still pissed though. Y'all see that? I'm not the only one that peeps that Freen was still like, Freen was like, that wasn't good enough. <laughs> Freen was still mad about it. Freen was 100% still mad about it. Oh, this is the one with the hands, y'all. There was one where, like I said, Freen was rubbing lotion on another fan. And that was the one time where I saw Becky look like she was really about to whoop somebody's ass. You said Becky be playing in Freen's face. <laughs> Becky do be playing. <laughs> Becky do be playing in Freen's face. She said, uh, yeah, you better hurry up and fix that. Mommy equals the fans, baby Becky. And then Honey is the fans that would date her. Right. And then, thank you, Jay Sean. And then uh, Darling or T-Doc is uh, Freen. So, yeah. But she, Becky be playing with her life. She don't just be playing in Freen's face. She be playing with her own life. I'm so happy that you love your gift. I do, sweetheart. I really do. I love it. Thank you, Nat. This the one right here. Look, this another one. 
Oh, see, I don't know what I don't know who that might be copyrighted. Look, she was like, "Why are you holding her? Like, what are you doing?" Oh, this is the one. Look at Freem. Look at Freem's face, y'all. Watch Freem's face. Look at her. She's not. She's dead ass, bro. That that's a whole fan sitting in front of them. She should be smiling and being like, "Oh, that's cute." Look at this. She was like, she and then she shook her head like, "Yeah, that's enough." I'm not playing with Freem. Look at Freem's face. Yo, hold on. I gotta go back. Freem was like, at first she was like, oh, okay. Then she looked, she cocked her head, bro. <laughs> when she cocked her, when she cocked her head, like, bitch, are you for real? Are you serious right now? She cocked her head like, are you serious? I'm so happy that you love you. Let me see. Yeah, the help, the head tilt, the head tilt was where I was like, yo, she's not playing with her. Look at that. She took, man, she tilted her head like, yeah, she looked like, I know you're not finna start another round with this. And look, Becky was just like nervous laughter. She was like nervous. <laughs> Yo, she was like nervous. Yo, you ever been out with your partner and they do some shit like that and embarrass you low key and you be trying to act like it wasn't as bad as it really is, but you know y'all finna fight when y'all get in the car? <laughs> I know that was mad specific. I've been there. But I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. Yeah, bruh. I'm trying to tell you, bro. You said what? Free and Becky. What you want me to look at? Free and Becky? What, what's that? Free and Becky love? What? You can see the essence of murder. Right. There was a fan that made them cry in this same place. The fan told them they were living the story of the gap currently and made it be. Oh, yeah. I remember that. I remember that. I do remember that. Yup. Be oh, he said, I think people be forgetting that Becky can kickbox when they flirt with Free. No, no, no. I don't think that that's what it is. I just think that because Becky is more playful. That's what I'm saying. I think that everybody knows that if, if Becky, and that's why I think Becky's more playful about it. If Becky wanted to, she could, <laughs> mommy, while most of the people that probably be messing with um, Freen. The issue is that when Becky gets jealous, she always plays it off like, ha, 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 you know, like with a laugh or a smile. Freen doesn't. Freen be looking like, I'll kill everyone in here. <laughs> with no remorse that's how i be looking at that's how i take it when freeing becky oh you said freeing becky be getting uh beck getting jealous and pissed i know becky gets jealous it'll never compare to me how freeing gets though but i'll look it up i got you hold on what's it called what's the freeing becky love i got you but to me it's never it never gives the same energy i don't care bro it just doesn't it never gives the same energy all right, so I'm gonna go to the, you said go to the account and you said it's the first video. Is it really the first video? Cause I don't want to have to like search. What video is it? Come on. She gets quiet. That one time the lady sat on Freen's lap. Freen like, I will air the shit out. Oh, Freen is definitely with the shits. I thought Becky would drop kick that host right there. It doesn't wonder if it's their age too. It could be their age. It could be the age difference because Freen is uh, 24. She turns 25 this year, right? And then Becky turns 21. She's only 20. So it could be that. Where's the, um, what video do you want me to look at, Whitney? I got it pulled up. I got it pulled up, sweetie. I need to know. Or I'm going to have to go to another um video because I don't want to have to search. I just want to, you know. Hello, Whitney, you still there? Okay. I'm gonna have to go to something else then. Let's go back to the Free and Becky Jealousy joint. <clears throat> let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go. Oh, let me see. I'll type in, how about this? I'll type in Je Jealous Becky Armstrong. Y'all want that? How about that? Maybe that'll come. Maybe that'll bring some of her stuff up. I'm trying to tell you, but I still haven't seen a video that where she gets as angry. See, that's what I'm talking about. She be sitting there looking sad. <laughs> Why is you sad? The music, bro. The music always makes it worse. She over there looking sad, bro. She don't be giving. That's what I'm saying. She looking sad. She not giving me the same energy. Oh, this is the other angle. Remember when I told y'all they like they kissed? Somebody showed it from a different angle. Look at this. That candy fell. They was still going free. I mean, five was still getting hers. So look. I 
I don't know, bro. Cause, cause my question is, what's Charlotte chewing when all that candy fell out her mouth? What, what, what's she chewing? That's all I'm saying. Fifth video of search rehab, second row, in the middle. I think is what they're saying. Oh, Fa was waiting ten months for that moment. She was, man. Fa waited ten. Fa waited forever for that moment, bro. Oh, this one. Oh my God. Look at look at Infa. She was she. They are taking pictures in front of a crowd full of reporters, and she's just looking at. She was just looking at Charlotte's titties, like. Look. <laughs> she didn't give a damn. She grabbed Charlotte's ass in this one too, and then. Charlotte put that's why Charlotte put her hand back there like girl what you doing and look at her gonna bite her lip I'm tired of five five is a mess yo yeah star exactly exactly star if you put everything if you put what you're saying put it all in one comment go like for uh fifth row down I'll see the comments because the comments are coming in very fast so if you put if you put the comment down there I got you that's the same night when Fi got caught grabbing Charlotte ass. Yes, exactly. Yeah, she definitely got. She was. She was on one with this one. Oh, when they put the music behind it, it's even worse. Look at this. She's sitting there. I ain't even going. Now this part was funny though because I know a lot of people mistook this and they thought that uh, Charlotte was getting lost in her gaze. She wasn't. She was actually looking at a big ass pimple. <laughs> she was also looking at. She was actually looking at a big ass pimple on the side of Fi's uh, face. But let me tell you how this still plays into the couple shit. Because later on that night, she was popping them pimples. I'm sorry, but I'm not popping nobody's pimples who I'm not dating. I'm not popping nobody's pimples in general. That's gross to me. I know some of y'all love that. Some people have like this crazy fetish with that. I don't get it. But yeah, I'm not doing that. Oh, this was funny. You talking about jealous. This was funny. This chick, uh, she was a CEO. She kissed Fa on the on the cheek. Fa wasn't even expecting this kiss. Why? Ha and that's Charlotte bent over in the tub. Watch what Charlotte does when she turns around. Look. The music, bro. Look at even Fa was like, "Yo, look." Charlotte was like, "What the?" F she was like, "Oh, okay." She got, but they didn't show the whole clip. Cause in the whole clip, when Charlotte turned around. And she saw that chick was hugging on um file. She did. She walked, she, oh, but underneath the camera, like she didn't even care. She walked underneath the camera and walked off the set. She did. And anybody that saw that knows that. Charlotte sits with Ingfa laying in her lap, popping Ingfa pimples. Yes, she sure was. She sure was, bro. I was like, come on, bro. That's not. That's not accurate. That just doesn't seem right. <laughs> because she couldn't reach it. She said, this is what we doing now? Right. Shasha, you mean, oh, you said that's, that was her excuse because she couldn't reach it? It's just right here. You can pop a pimple on. It was, it was like right here. You can pop a pimple on the side of your head right there. Okay, Whitney. Thank you, sweetheart. I appreciate you. I'm sorry I wasn't able to get to the video that you was recommending, but um, I just could I The directions was just, you know, it was, it was miscommunication on both ends. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, have a beautiful night. Have a blessed night. I'm about to get off here. I'm getting off at uh, 8 o'clock. So, I'm going to watch. Let me see. There was one joint I really wanted y'all to see, though. Hold on. With Inglot. There was one. I'm trying to find that photo shoot, bruh. Where's the photo shoot? See more. No, I want to see videos, bro. I want to see more videos. Stop playing with me. Y'all know what I meant. Y'all knew what I meant. Y'all knew what I meant. Mm. Y'all know what I'm at. Mm. Oh, look at this Tina and this is Tina and Heidi, bro. Look at this shit here. But I'm trying to tell you, they are not. I don't. I do not think that they got anything going on. This is just how they are, because they and they both have the same energy. All right, Whitney, bye, sweetheart. I'm saying only pimple I popped uh, for someone was for my mom because she couldn't reach it. Right, like if it's on your back or something, that's something different, but. This joint right here? Come on, stop playing. You doing that because you in love. <laughs> you doing that because you in love. But look at these two. 
Heidi and Tina a mess. Can you do some more freeing and Becky before you end the live? Okay. What y'all gotta tell me what you what you want exactly though? Let me see. Uh, how about how about I just type in freeing Becky and we get some freaky shit going? How about that? Let me see if I can find some freaky stuff. There's a kiss. That was the kiss that y'all was talking about. Uh. That's a spoiler though. For the record, for the record, that's a spoiler though. They were cute. Um, I'm trying to find some. See, this is all the stuff that didn't happen. This, bro, this, this is going to be, this is still my favorite right now, bro. I don't care. Becky was looking so, that's, that Becky right there, bro. This Becky right here is the Becky that don't be, <laughs> that's Becky Armstrong. You know what I'm saying? That's that Becky right now. I love that blonde hair on frame. Y'all like the blonde hair? Yeah, you gonna have me continuing down the rabbit. I hope y'all. I hope when y'all get off this live tonight, y'all definitely go down the rabbit hole, man. Y'all gotta go down the rabbit hole because I'm trying to tell you, these two right here, they be on another level. Hold on, I'm trying to see what the look at this shit. Now this is I know I get it. This is a uh, this is a TikTok trend. They was doing that thing, you know. Y'all know that TikTok. I can't play the music because it'll get crazy. But um, I don't want nothing to get copyrighted. But these two. Hold on, I'm trying to find, where is, where is, dang it, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm not gonna let y'all go till I find that video. I'm looking for something in particular. I'm looking for something in particular. Uh, bro, they, they have so many fans though. They be posting so much that you can find something and try that joint be gone in two seconds. You be like, where the hell did it go? <gasps> Was it? No, no, that's not it. I know that's right. You better get it. This is. I'm sorry, but this is. <laughs> this is still my favorite. <laughs> this is still my favorite. Oh God, it was everything. It was the hand, it was the confidence, it was the way she stepped in. Did she step down off of something? Like, what is she, why she look so tall compared to Freen? I thought Freen was taller than her. She stepped, she came down off that, bruh. Becky a mess. I love that strawberry blonde on her too. That strawberry blonde on her is so adorable. Rabbit hole, here we go. You still doing an elite live tomorrow? I am, I am. I am gonna go uh, live tomorrow. Like I said, it's gonna be during the Super Bowl. It probably won't be as long as this, obviously. You know what I'm saying? But I'm definitely gonna go live. But it's for illicit, uh, solicit elite members only. The live that I'm doing tomorrow is for solicit elite members only. Um, I got something I wanna tell you guys, so I'm gonna take that time to tell you then. If you guys want to join you know, obviously become a member. You can, you are more than welcome to do that. Um, my solicit elite members, I feel like obviously since you go the extra step, I can have a little bit more of an intimate relationship with you. So there's things that I want to share with you and things I want to talk to you. I want it to be more like a collaborative relationship. Um, and so there's going to be some things that we're going to be able to talk about, um, you know, in private, so to speak. So I'm looking forward to talking to you guys because I really need your input on some things. And then I also want to tell you guys some things. Oh, this moment, this. Is there music? Of course. They were crying after, no, where's that? Oh my God, I gotta find this one video. So they were doing, you know how they did a mock? For, so somebody did, it was, I feel like it's under my like videos. I'm pretty certain it is. So let me go to my profile. They did a mock wedding. And in the mock wedding, they actually did um, freeing, like Be Becky and Freen were like standing off to the side watching, um, as you can see, you, you guys can see what my like videos are filled with, um, were standing off to the side watching the video. And you could tell that, Fr that Becky was getting emotional. She was literally getting emotional watching them. And I think they were doing like, you know, like I said, the mock ceremony and I feel like somebody said it in the comments, the way that Freen like leaned in, it was almost like she leaned in to be like, this is going to be real one day. And Becky like closed her eyes. Like she was taking that moment in. I got to find that before we get off alive. I have to find that one before we get off live. 
It's not that one. Is it? No. No, no, no. It's not that one. That's when they were just singing. It's not that one. Oh my God. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Y'all, everybody, does anybody know what I'm talking about? Thank you, Sharna. Thank you for becoming a member, sweetie. Thank you. Let me see. I, you know exactly, Kira, you know what I'm talking about. Okay, good. I'm glad that I got, I know I'm not the only one. Oh, look at this shit. Real quick. This is England. This was them, I think, today. Look at them. So, Char uh, Fa, Fa, Fa was playing with her, but Charlotte, like, reached for her hand because she thought she was serious at first. And then she gonna sit there and do the little caressing of the finger. I ain't playing with them. And then she gonna sit there and do the lingering touch with the fingers. They are child. They, and still, and said in this live, in this live, um, Fa fed, uh, she was feeding Charlotte. And she's and Charlotte goes, I wonder what sin I wonder how single people eat chili paste. And Fa looked at her and said, But I thought you were single. She goes, I am, but somebody's feeding me right now. Fa looked at her and said, That's not what you said. <laughs> Yo, they are a mess. Oh, Kira, you looking on yours too? Okay. You said go back up. It was on the left. For real? I missed it? The free and Becky joint? Hold on, my left or your left? Cause I can't, you know. No, it wasn't. If, if if you're talking about this one, it wasn't that one, sweetie. It's not that one. Did I miss it? No, no, it's not this one either. This is the one where Becky. This was a good one too, though. This is the one where Becky goes, "I'm getting married," and Freen or I'm married, and Freen looked at her and was like, she was like blushing and happy because Becky seemed so excited about it. It's not this one though. This was a cute moment, but it wasn't this one. The one I'm talking about. Yeah, hold on. You're right. I might have. Let me make sure I didn't miss it, though. I'm pretty certain I didn't miss it. But the one I'm talking about, they're in their wedding dresses and they're standing off to the side. I don't think that I missed it. I do be scrolling hella fast, though. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I feel like it was further back because I've been down this rabbit hole for a long time. So sometimes I'll be liking like hundreds of videos. I'll be like, oh, shit, I got to slow down. Uh. Yeah, I see I got some Louisiana and Valentina in there. You know I got some those. Those my OGs right there. Them the OGs right there. Damn it. I am not getting off this live until I find that video, bro. I'm so pressed. You said not that one. You said it's on. Yes! You're right. It's on Isis. Yeah, because I. you're right. Because I follow them and they really. Oh, look. I'm already following them. I'm already following them. Let me just go back here. All right, now where is that video? Wanna make sure I don't miss it. Oh, here it is. This is the one. Oh, they playing music, see I can't do it. So look at how Becky is looking, y'all. Becky was just like enjoying the moment. She was looking at the memories. She started getting overwhelmed, so she had to look away. And she was almost like looking at her dress like, damn, I wish this was real. And and Freem, it's like Freem felt her do that. And then she looked at her and she almost reassured her. She like leaned in and I swear, nobody knows what they actually said. But my creep obsessive fan mind says, she said, um, this is going to be real one day. And because watch the way Becky reacts. Like look how Becky looking at her like, I really wish this was a real moment. And Freem leans in. And then watch how Becky reacts to whatever Freen said. And then she kissed her on the cheek. The bro. Oh, Shasha, you wanna be a mod? I got you, baby. Let me make you a mod real quick. You wanna be a mod before we go? Hello, everyone. What's up, Sarah? What's up? I'm delusional. So she definitely said that. Thank you. That's what I'm saying. I'm say I said the same thing. I was like, she to me, she definitely said that. She definitely said that just the whole way Becky was looking like she looked down at the dress like, damn, I wish this was real. And Freen looked, oh, bruh, trying to tell you, I love this video. Yes, yes, Chris. I love this video so much, bro. I swear the way Becky just like closed her eyes to absorb what Freen said. I know she was like, baby, it's going to be real one day. Just wait, just wait. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. I miss you guys. I miss you. All right, I'll talk to you later. I'm going to end the live now. Say bye-bye. Love you guys.